Good morning, spaceman. Welcome on board. Welcome back. X4. Hello, air name. Welcome, welcome. Tell me why did I thought that you're American? Bidrenth, welcome on board. Hello. Good morning. How are you doing everyone? I have no idea. <laughs> me neither. <laughs> I don't know why. Carixus, good morning. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Great moment to start my Thursday evening. Ah. That's indeed a good timing. Just a second. <clears throat> Battlefield's already next week? Oh, it's a reveal or something. What is that? The initial release date is October 22nd. July 22nd? It says October 22nd. Sort of a reveal. Is that the alpha test? Um, EA Play Live on 22nd July. Ah. This is where they want to talk about more about it. Oh, I guess. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Dead Drongo, hey, welcome on board. Oh, oh, um, I am prepared. Cheers. Sotar, welcome on board. Enough time to upgrade my AMD rig. <laughs> I don't know if that's enough time. Not enough for the GPU. I think. Well, maybe we'll see a uh, 3080 Super until then. Uh, 22nd October, maybe not. Maybe not. <sighs> Malicious Fat, welcome on board. Hello, hello. Open source fidelity effects. On NVIDIA cards? I mean, they just showed it on a 1060 because it's 
possible. But Nvidia has to has to do it. Hey Ryder, welcome on board. I don't know if they were doing it. True Viking, welcome on board. Hello, hello. Hello everyone. Glad that you're gathering here. I hope you saw the latest video on YouTube about supply stations. Uh, if you did, thank you so much that you were one of the 200 up until now. Summertime is difficult. <laughs> Summertime is difficult. Experiencing that for the first time feels a little oof. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know if I like the new battlefield. I really don't know. So let me say something for everyone that is in here early. <clears throat> Next week, we're going to change something up. I know there's a lot of changes recently. RimWorld, uh, RimWorld finished yesterday. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, RimWorld finished yesterday. And... Uh, so there is a gap to fill. And next week will be even even more different. Uh, I talked about it with my wife and I came to the conclusion that it's not really healthy for us if I keep streaming at 6 p.m. Central European. Because she's working until... 4.30 comes back home at 5 and I start streaming at 6. So that's why the streams are going to change and they're going until 6 p.m. It's not really early streams, it's... It's afternoon then I will still need the mornings for something like YouTube videos um, YouTube videos workouts um, some other stuff like Estrella stuff and, and, and stuff like that and so that we have a an evening together because that's not really healthy for a relationship I mean our relationship is fine everything is really 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 good like for the last nine years I don't say that there's anything anything um, to worry about um, but I just feel that it would be way more beneficial for us if we would have the evenings together for whatever even if it's even if she's got no time and i can still then do something for youtube or so uh, but then we had a choice so for the long run to be able to do that for a long time i need to change the times because otherwise i don't know if i can keep it up for a long time Five PM, perfect hour for Spain. Listen, Captain, while repair laptops or phones. <laughs> nice. There you go. You can just, you know what you can do, Ryder. I have, I have, um, uh, I have a um, solution for that. You just place a very big, and I'm talking about eighty plus inch screen into your store. And you leave that stream running there for the complete five or six hours. I always wanted to be in a store or something. Don't don't 
let the news run there. Let that stream runs there. <laughs> Come on, that. So yes, I'm changing the times from... I still don't know what that is. 12 a.m. or 12 p.m. Some say so, the others say different. So from 12 o'clock until... From 1200 UTC? No, wait, it's not UTC. Uh, from 1200 to 1800 Central European. <laughs> hey, PC, welcome aboard. Similar, but well with a 22 PC monitor. Okay. See, you say PM. 12, 11 p.m. But 12 started at a.m., didn't it? Like, if you say 12 o'clock, it could be a.m. or p.m. If you just mean 12 o'clock. If you say the afternoon already started, it's 12 p.m. If you say it's coming from the morning, it's 12 a.m. So weird. That would be better for me too. That's why I asked you about if which time zone you're living in. <laughs> so yeah, changing the stream times uh, next week, starting next week. Um, because I just don't don't think that it's beneficial for the relationship to keep it like it was. But good thing. On the other hand, so it's not only changing the times, but good thing on the other hand is we're streaming more. So I'm starting at 12 and I'm going until 6. That means 6 hours instead of 4 hours of gameplay. Isn't that something good? And we will keep the Sunday evening. Sunday is still there. Sunday evening, coffee stream, nothing will change there. That's the perfect time to sit together, drink a coffee, talk about stuff, and that will be it. So Sunday evening streams will start still at 6 p.m. Or if I say something else, then a little bit later, but not before 6 p.m. Co uh, coffee table will still be the same. But it will stop when we run out of interesting things to talk about. Uh, no more gameplay afterwards. And if we have to talk a lot uh, uh, stuff, then uh, we're keeping it for hours. And uh, we're keeping it just chatting only. So Sundays are the days where we are talking about stuff that's, that's happening throughout the week. Uh, in games or other things, uh, we can watch some YouTube videos together and do stuff like that. Yeah. Hey, Captain Rubble. Yeah, I will. I will post something about that. Um, yeah, stream schedule is changing more to to more European times. <laughs> Let's say that. Uh, 12, 12 o'clock until 6 p.m. From 12 to 6 p.m. I think that's, that's how, it, can you say that? 12 to 6 p.m. Yeah. Betrayal, I still have to watch your supply station video. Ah, oh, nice. Um, actually I got an, a comment which I don't think is true and I want to see if it's true. First comment I got on the video, so let's change into that and go into the game, I would say. Give me some music back. Oh, and by the way, if you want to have my controls, I have the profile, the Thrustmaster T1600 FCS Hotas Captain Collins profile. Uh, it's in Discord. It's in the uh, announcement channel in Discord, and then you can get the profile for... <laughs> <laughs> there you go.
My thrust master arrived already. Now I have to configure it. You it arrived already? Wait, you you What? <laughs> oh, that was fast. You ordered it yesterday. What the heck? <laughs> wow. I saw it and, and it went through. It went through. It was not too much, but um at least you know, Amazon is not giving you too much for electronic stuff. Um just a few percent like 3% or something from uh, from from uh, the netto value from the net value um, but it's good as a metric for uh, Thrustmaster so it, it's a good metric so I can I can say Thrustmaster hey look at that. that there are people that buying it because of the video and there was another one today so thank you whoever bought the the uh, Hotas today <laughs> that you did it from my link. Thank you so much. Did you also add the low layout to the PDF? No, I was like choose it either to occupied or too lazy. One of it. Um. It was interesting to see how you set up your Hotas controls. They're very different from mine. Oh, I did like your strafe control setup. Ah, oh, the strafe control. I, I hate it that they put the strafe control onto this knob here. I thought like the, immediately the moment that I got the, the throttle, I was like, oh, that's perfect to look around. And then I saw, oh, they put strafing on this. Uh, I don't like it. So I tried to get some some other strafing controls. Since you mentioned them, any answer from Thrustmaster? No. Unfortunately not. Maybe they're on vacation, you never know. Uh, but I sent them... I sent them um, the proposal for a... for a trackable link. Uh, I sent them the info that the click-through rate of the video is more than 5%, which is really good. Really, really, really good. Um... And that already two people bought one. So you never know how they answer. Never know. Same controller as me, but I use the rudder pedals too. Oh, nice rider. Unfortunately, I need the pedals for yaw because my twist axe is having issues. Oh, I heard that a lot. Could be something with dust. Or yesterday and you arrived today 30. <laughs> wow. My one day shipping is never actually one day shipping. Well, Amazon Prime is really good. You can use it for your favorite streamer, whoever it is, and uh, leave a Prime subscription which doesn't which doesn't cost you anything. Additionally, it doesn't need to be in this channel, but choose your streamer of your choice because it's uh, just um lost money for whoever streamers out there that you want to support if you don't do it it's it's lost my prime subscription will renew the next few days oh. the thrustmaster setup looks epic <laughs> it's so nice Already got mine, so can't use the link. That's fine. Might getting it to hope I can also play Star Citizen with it one day. Oh, there is something. Captain. Captain underscore Rollabelt. Just resubscribed. Continuing duty as Spaceman First Class. Five months already. How time flies. That's true, Captain Rollabelt. That's true. Thank you so much for the tier two. Thank you. That's a lot. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Where did you put strafing? Uh, horizontal strafe on the pedals on throttle. Um, oh. One strafing is here. That's that's one strafing. And the other uh, up and down strafing is on this one here. On this knob. You can't really see it, right? There on this knob is up and down strafing. And this is left and right. And this is look around. Oh yeah, just like you see. Oops. 
Uh, I'm so used to using the um, keyboard and mouse that I need to change. Uh, need to switch in my head. <clears throat> ah. I actually have the strafe controls on the throttle joystick. <laughs> The T1600 would be the perfect controller if they'd flip the twist axis sensor upside down so dust wouldn't settle on it. The twist axis sensor. The twist sensor upside down? What do you mean? Like in... We're talking about this here, right? About... This, right? Who said that? Yeah, Arquebus. If you have absolute throttle, then using a stick as a throttle is just firing on the arm. Two sticks is good if you have relative throttle in the game. X Force designed with absolute throttle. Ah, I saw someone playing Star Citizen today with two sticks. I think you, uh, I know what you mean. The twist sensor is inside the joystick and dust gets on it and it makes the twist axis go haywire. Yeah, the, exactly. The twist sensor is in here. It's, it's, it's somewhere in here, but how can you put it upside down? I don't get it. And where is dust coming in there? Because this part here underneath is not moving. This here, when you, when you twist it, it's not moving. So it's everything happening in, in the joystick itself. But where is there dust coming in? I don't get it. You can't put it upside down. I meant when they designed the stick, they should have done that. The sensor is actually just the mirror and optical sensor. Um, some people say that for space sim is better two joysticks than a hotas. Oh. I like strafing on the little joystick as that's analog, gives me more control. Huh. I don't use strafing that much in X4, you know. I have to drive now. I'll be back later on. <laughs> okay. Got to go collect the family. Back. Okay, everyone's leaving. See, that's why uh, streaming until 6 p.m. is perfect because then everyone can leave and make their stuff. And uh, you can be here until that point. <laughs> the way people usually fix it is by taking the thing apart and wiping off the sensor that solves it for a while. It has to be an issue with us. Oh. Strafe that dude in front of you. <laughs> hey, Baba. <laughs> so, let's take a look around. Uh, we can actually undock here. Let's go. And I cannot fly backwards, by the way. At the moment. So, oh, look at that. Strafing. Nice. Whoops. Ah. Boosting. Nice. Oh. Um. Short range transporter. Oh, I don't have weapons. Damn it. Ow. Oh. <laughs> I don't have weapons. That's uh. That's bad. Because I'm in. Oops. This thing here, and I don't have weapons. Look. No weapon assigned. Dang it. Um short range trans short range. Short oh, there range are two. Transporter. Short range transporter maintenance vessel. So 
the big issue that I have at the moment is that range transporter. Okinawa. that if you want uh, that if you want to dock at the Okinawa. station, you cannot really get the station. You know, it's hard to it's hard to get the station without using the mouse as a uh, maintenance vessel as a target. How do you do that? Hey, Big Ben, welcome on board. How do you... How do you get that station as a target? There's a hotkey for targeting ahead. Yeah, I'm, I'm using that. Vessel. It's on top, but... Maintenance vessel. It's hard to get the station. Now I have a beam turret. Short range transporter. Maintenance vessel. Orbital supply base. Ah, no. That takes a while. What a beautiful ship. Oh my god, Saroon. Please. Please. And you can assign it to a button. Let's Okinawa. see. If I, t if I, if I do maintenance that and I try to, to get the station, supply. it's really hard. Okinawa. Okay. And if I just get the mouse and I click anywhere on the station, Orbital supply it always gets the station. Trigger. <laughs> yes, it is. That was a trigger. <laughs> that's right. Hey, Sarun, welcome on board. Yeah, that's true. Usually I have to target the central mode. Yeah, exactly. Are you in gamepad and joystick mode? Um, No. I'm in... Gamepad mode is off. Gamepad mode is off. B direction of throttle also. Is it true that the mouse is better for precise targeting, which is unfortunate? Uh, it is true to a to a specific point because if you are trying to target a surface object with your mouse, you are kind of limited because this thing here. This square is blocking every surface target on uh, capital ships. If this square is above a surface target and you want to um, and you want to target the sur this this specific surface target with your mouse, that doesn't work. And uh, it you can only target surface targets around that um, around that square. That's really weird. Really weird. But it is how it is. For that, you can use a directional pad and switch between surface targets. Pretty easily. Docking granted. There you go. Come on. Boost. Whoa. Okay. This. I think I'm a little bit too sensitive with my controls. Well, a little bit too sensitive. Hey, CG Groff, welcome on board. So Try switching on. There's a separate mappable command for surface. It's an honor to have you aboard. I do have subsystems. Uh, I was I was just talking about differences between uh, or if the mouse is the more precise targeting um, option that you can use so most of the times yes but not all of the times that's what i uh, wanted to say there um exactly i think that my that my uh, sensitivity is too high I have a feeling that that it's too high. I'm I'm just using it a little bit, and it's and it's really all over the place. So pick a little fun boat. It's an open market like that. I'm definitely going to be getting a truck bell soon. The mouse is just so immersion breaking. I need something that feels more futuristic. <laughs> a trackball. Yeah, a trackball could um 
could immerse you more, I guess, than having a mouse somewhere on your system, than just having a ball, which you then use like that. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Wait, was that your was that your comment on uh, the YouTube video with the mouse breaking the immersion? Was that your comment? Yeah, that was your comment. Ah, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Cool. Huh. <laughs> For shooter. Funny, isn't the trackball older than mouse? I guess so. But it has nothing to do with uh, being old or anything. It's just the device that you wouldn't have a mouse in a cockpit, but a trackball somewhere on your seat or so. That's something that you could imagine a little bit more. Right? Otis and Pedals is great. To be honest, I want VR now. I might even go back, try X Rebirth. <laughs> okay, well, it's the future. Imagine trying to use the mouse in zero G. It's like, yeah, I'm just placing the mouse here and I'm doing something else. I'm taking the mouse and doing something with it again. I wouldn't have a mouse on a spaceship with active gravity. With active gravity, maybe, yeah. So... Can I jump in here? No. What about the research? Uh, Grand Exchange. Minor, worthy. Oh. Now go and mine. Good. Ah, all the small little details. All the small details. All the small things. Oh yeah. And I wanted to see something. Saturn 1. Are you... You do not have any capacity in there. You do have... Stop it for a while. You do have energy cells. The trader loaded off the... I need to... I need to prove a point here. I need to prove a point. And the station account is zero. I'm going to the bathroom uh, a moment. Read that and disagree.
So, just to give you an idea on uh, how much your comments on YouTube actually influence me, um, that I'm not just putting the, the videos out there and I'm like, who cares whatever happens, this video is making money, I don't care. For the last two hours, I was questioning myself if this person is right and if I said something completely wrong and I made a video that is not working and I have just told you absolute nonsense. For the last two hours I was sitting here and I was like, damn it. Is that true? I, th I, th I think that that worked for me. But man, what if what if that person is, is, is right? And then the next one, I agree. I'm like... Is that possible? I mean, did, it, did I just oversee that? Did it, was it not working? And I just didn't see it? Hey, Polar Bear, welcome aboard. Let me just answer that comment really quick. Hi. I'm live at the moment. Sorry, this is bothering me. Sometimes some 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 comments trigger you as a creator where you question yourself if you're right or not. And this is just like one of these comments. That's that's triggering me. Because I knew I was right and that person made me doubt myself. And uh I should more trust in myself. the end if you like join our discord and we can have a look good I'm so glad that it worked I'm just so glad that it's working like intended like i said in this video and do not, not i do not have to change anything in this video it's right as it is and we're good to go <clears throat> hey little bull welcome on board mobby welcome on board oops maybe it was fixed in 4.0 you have to remember that part At the end, it's not on me. They they see that the uh, that the version is different, but I can I 
I can add that used version 4.1 beta 3. That's a good point. Now it's in the description and everything's fine. Captain is so strange to hear you so under the weather. Captain, it is so strange to hear you so under the weather. Wait, what do you mean? What? Hey Cap, don't beat yourself too hard over it. At the end of the day, your video trained thousands of pilots, including myself, and that's what matters. Right or wrong, the biggest picture is that a lot of us couldn't play this game as good as we do without your guidance. Thank you so much, little boy. But I still want to bring the best. <laughs> I still want to do good videos and the best videos. And, and I still want to bring you as much information as I can in just a few minutes. And the trading station and repeat orders, everything in this video um, that's useful to make a trading station um, with repeat orders takes you about... Three and a half minutes um, to get an overview and to use it for your game. Three and a half minutes. That's why I put the ore stations into this video too, because the video would just be like four minutes long. <laughs> like, I want to go, I, I, I want to get to the point really quick and I don't want to tell you any any fluff in the videos. The, the streams are there for fluff. We, we do the fluff here. If you like the fluff, you're here. <laughs> but if you just want to have the information, you watch the you watch the uh, um, the uh, YouTube videos, and that's it. <laughs> we are the fluff. <laughs> hey, dude, fast, welcome on board. Keep having issues with this game. The economy keeps grinding to a halt, and factions stop doing anything. Anyone know how to fix that? You, what is fluff? Um, uh, um, um, with fluff, I mean, um, where with fluff, I mean a lot of uh, small talk and stuff that's maybe unimportant, or we're trying to do something fifty times and whatsoever. That's that's like the fluff. You know, it's it's all the stuff that that's just filling time and doesn't give you any new information. We're just here to having fun. <laughs> uh, I guess this is an ongoing dilemma for content creators, the pressure of having to be right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Since Ubisoft doesn't tell you about every small change, maybe it was fixed since Ubisoft. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. Basically that, I think so. Anyway, I proved my point. That's fine. I double checked it. It's working. I'm glad. I'm relieved. It's fine. I can sleep at night. <laughs> so we're good. We are good. Um. Yeah. And the trading station works as intended. Uh, I I remember that the trading station had like no energy cells at all all the time. And at that point, I was doubting myself that if it that that person could be right, but it, the 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 trading station is always running low on stock because the the traders are just rushing to the station whenever they see a new a new shipment arrive. You know, it's like oh, there's something on the market. Go and grab all of it. <laughs> That's why the station is like always out of stock. <laughs> Always. Deadless, thank you so much. Cheers. Boom. And that was fluff, by the way. All of it now. <laughs> 40 minutes already. Exclamation point, Hotas. Ah! I'm too... Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I need to have a, a different keyboard. 
Good morning, Dadless. How's the hotel? Uh, I don't really know. I was just flying around in a rip here. <laughs> I have no idea. I want to go into the uh, into the fun boat and really give it a try. Uh, I had no time to do so yet. Oh, hey, wait. Maybe we can... Ooh, maybe we can take a look with the sin for another... Um... Entering oh, wait, belt. you did destroy... Oops, wow. What happened with this here? You did destroy the... Uh... The, the 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 cock hive right last time we've been in here I I, I told the destroyer to just shoot the cock hive right nice cock. Cock. entering system grand oh exchange. yeah sorry dude fast if you're still in here uh to answer your question um an economy that is grinding itself into a halt <sighs> needs to get and pu a push from outside and you are the outside you need to push the economy so that it can start again producing things either you do that by providing the um, the factions with minerals and sending a lot of minerals uh, into auto mining you're uh, building stations that supply these economies with um, basic wares so that they can produce more again. Or you shoot all of them down and just take their space. <laughs> it's a simulated economy. Everyone needs resources. And if they're running out of resources, that means you need to provide them with them. That's that's what you need to do. Faction stations are all full. They just don't fight or build anything anymore. They need to fight more or you need to kill them all. Yep. Yeah. yeah, most likely kill them all. <laughs> kill them all! <laughs> exactly. Uh, I didn't even realize before it came out. I was surprised when I saw the new resource probe info layout. Oh, the info layout, yes. In German, it would be like big piles of dust. That is what the com officer tells me. A big pile of dust. A haufen Staub. What? And heli. <laughs> Uh, nice that it's supposed to be a good one. Paddles make a big difference to not essential if you joystick twists, but a worthy addition. Yeah, it's so, I just, I, so, let's, let's, uh, move on to the, uh, to the fun boat. So I just got the, the HOTAS, um, two weeks ago from Thrustmaster directly. Entering system, open market. From Thrustmaster directly. Oh my goodness. And, um... That's all connection that we have at the moment. They just sent me that thing um, for a YouTube video. The YouTube video that I uploaded yesterday. And that was it. That was that was it. There's no contract, no anything. There's nothing else involved. Um, the links that I have put in the videos are standard Amazon affiliate links. So there is also no promo or any trackable link or whatever. And um, that's about it. We do not have that deep of a connection. Okay. Got it, Captain Rulevald. Got it. That's a cool looking Hotas. That one actually reminds me of a system that I had before. It was called Cyborg 3D from Cytec. 
Um, that also had like 12 buttons here. It was a little bit different looking, but it also had... Um, it was looking almost the same. Just, just take a look uh, on Google. Cyborg 3D from Cytec. Um, there's, there, it, it didn't evolve that much from, from there until the uh, 16K. Destroyer got one damn job to destroy and he did a good job. <laughs> That's true, Sarun. Okay, so here we are in a katana. At least the boost is a real boost in a katana, right? Whoa, what's that? That's another cock hype. Did we? Oh yeah, okay, we did it. Um, let's go and fly into... Oh wait, before we do anything... Uh, we have that one in Saturn. With... No, wait. That one in Saturn. Information. Uh... Click. Click. Upgrade. Okay. Confirm that order. What about you? Mm hmm. The same. Okay. And then we're bringing these two again to the Tilodi Wharf. There you go. Both are loaded. Attack. Oh, upgrade. 65. Oh, nice. Oh. Oh, I forgot to press the button. Damn. This button here. Confirm. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, I know what's going on. With the mouse. Ha! I know what's going on. Uh, the mouse sensitivity is, of course, changed. <gasps> Sorry. Because I loaded a new profile. There you go. Save that profile. There. Okay. Got it. That should be better. Um, where are we going? Okay. <laughs> okay, autopilot is which thingy? That one? No. Damn it. That <laughs> that was removing the guidance. Ah. Nope. Okay, once more. Autopilot. Autopilot ah. engaged. Okay, cool. Third D-pad to the top. Ah, so much stuff to do. <laughs> Is this the same playthrough from 4.0 launch? Yes. That's the Terran playthrough. And unfortunately, I have bad news for you. What, what, I mean, it's, it's not really bad news. It's news. Uh, are you going to fight the Argons today? Yes, that's what I'm trying to do right now. We're going to fight Xenon. Uh, Xenon. Zyre versus Argon. Have you used the missions in the game to bring peace to the universe? <laughs> the opposite. Build the shipyard in a war zone and no economy problems. <laughs> there you go. Oh, you're talking to Dude Fast. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Dude fast, Geist, and Ryder <laughs> trying to help you there. 
Uh, Thrustmaster make decent stuff. I use one of their Hota systems, a wheel and a gear shifter too. Nice. That's the next thing that I want to have from them. A, a, a wheel. <laughs> Let's see. Then we're playing Formula One. Lul. <laughs> then we're playing Formula One. <laughs> we're in here. <laughs> because it's a good space game. And... um. After that, of course, uh, somewhere down the road is a war talk, but, you know, anyway, Thrustmaster is cool. I like that product. For car wheel, fun attack is the king, but the price is... I drive futurist. Use the Hotas to play SnowRunner and Euro Truck. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the idea is not not so bad. It feels more like it feels like like uh, driving a uh, a tractor. A, a tractor has also sticks and and stuff. You know, you can. I think you can also drive a tractor with sticks. So then I, oh, playing playing a a trucker like that. Um, oh, let's go, honk honk. Honk, honk, honk. <laughs> but, oh, I have to confess something. I have I have to confess something. Because uh, we can play trucker. We can play s space trucker. Oops. We, we can we can play space truckers in the future. I have bought it today. But that takes some time until we dive into that. <laughs> Which ship? The Aurora. The Aurora. Um, yeah. Uh well use the hope that oh that's yeah, I agree went for the uh, nasty press. I feel like you need a cheat sheet on your desk. <laughs> that's true. That's true, Arkebus. You can use a flight yoke. Oh that one you mean <laughs> Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Just don't push the self-destruct and you'll be fine. Hey, crazy bastards, welcome on board. Hey, Vumada, welcome on board. Tangil, welcome on board. Tangil, thank you so much for your very nice YouTube comment. I just saw it. Thank you so much. Thanks, 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 Tangil. Farming simulator incoming. Oh, farming simulator just released uh, today on the Xbox Game Pass. <laughs> It's just released today. <laughs> uh, can you click it? Hello? Oh my goodness. Uh. <laughs> so it's not that far. I mean... <laughs> it's there. <laughs> we can play it whenever you want to. <laughs> War talk with the stick extension and desk mounts. Ooh. Found a good layout template. Can I put a link here? Uh, yes, you can, Archibus. You can put links in here. An objective decision? Exactly, Sarun. Yes. And No, actually, this was a subjective decision because I know that I need a versatile ship at the start and I want to have a ship that's Capable of more than just fighting and flying somewhere. So that's why I got the Aurora. Prepare for buy a little ship for 400 euros. I will never do that. <laughs> Worth getting if you get a wheel. Okay, Big Bang. I'm going to play SC as soon as I can buy a new computer that can run it. <laughs> that's a little bit bothering because I'm still running a 1080 non-TI. And um, I don't know if, if that will, if that will be enough for 
this game, you know. Uh, extract intelligence. Station module scan. Satellites required in Argon space. We can do that. We can do that. I fly there myself. Okay, wait. Oh my goodness. Uh, travel mode. Travel mode. Travel mode. Ah, perfect. What is this? Scan mode. What is this? Zeta. And that is long range. Okay. Travel mode. Good. Good. Let's go. Aderok. Oh, by the way, Aderok. Hey, welcome on board. That's a John Deere tractor too. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny dear 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 Johnny Johnny dear 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 There's a there's there's a song about it Entering you know system. you know that market. there's a song about Johnny dear Nice love that That's the template makes it easy to visualize you can just put the uh, jpeg at the control info Oh yeah, I got something similar from uh, Captain Rulevold, actually. Thank you. It seems the same. Configuration sheet by Commander Bezdi. And what did I got in the Discord? <laughs> That's the ground. same. Oh. Ah! Come on. Um. Disable that. I got the same already from uh, Captain Rulevold, even with. With. Um. Already. Stuff that, that you can. You can already write in. Oh, cool. <laughs> nice. Thanks for that. <laughs> Salute to Commander Bezdi, the PDF author. Exactly. Oh, hey, look at that. N. Let's go. Um. No. Oh. Come on. No, where are you going? Ah, damn it. Oh, I was conf Oh my god, I get so... Ah. Ah, screw that. Huh? What are you doing? Okay, weird. Uh, something changed. Wait. Ah, this. Okay, this is this this one here. <laughs> Everything that feels so new. Okay, that feels definitely so new. <laughs> so how do I look left and right and end and up and down with that stick when I'm on a platform? You mean this here? Wait, or what do you mean? Entering system, guiding star. Thank you, Ken Tango. Thank you. On a station, uh, easy. So. On a station, you need to go into controls, platform movement. Look left and right, look up and down. These two, change these two. For FP uh, is for first person. 
first person walk and strafe. So, walking, strafing, ugh, looking up and down. That looks like I'm uh, I'm playing with a nipple. Mmm, <laughs> nipple playman. Naughty. It's different than in the cockpit. It is different, yeah, but it, like I said, FP, first person. That's the thing that you need to change. Uh, in your cockpit, it is... In your cockpit, it's camera. Camera left, right, up and down. These, these four are in a cockpit. That's also the same. That's the same knob. You can uh, give it two different controls. So I'm still very far. I'm running 20, 80 super and I get 24 FPS. Oh my goodness. Flight is disabled. Why? What am I doing here? Okay, maybe maybe I need to adjust that a little bit. Yeah, that's better. That feels better. Put right there. Oh. Hmm. The problem with Star Citizen is that the optimization box are very hit and miss. Sometimes it's butter smooth, other times it's got dementia. <laughs> well. Super highway, unknown sector. Interesting. They reckon the next generation of GPUs are going to see very large performance gains, but they are at least 19, 18 months away. Yeah, I know. going on advanced satellite what argon federation advanced satellite huh i'm so confused I get out of my bed, fall through the floor, die, rinse and repeat. Oh my goodness. Who's David Braben? <laughs> what? Cap playing with a nipple. <laughs> hey, error name. Thank you so much for making all these um, clips. Uh, my wife just uploaded one that you clipped yesterday in RimWorld and I credited you at least uh, as a name clipped by error name 1004 so thank you very much for doing that okay come on I need to no, I need to keep it here so they can see it so if I do stuff then you can see it That was your satellite. Okay, let's go. Happy that my clips are getting used. Yes, they are. They are. 100%. Go. What? Are you kidding me? What is going on? Rattlesnake. Marauder rattlesnake? Interesting. <laughs> The co-creator of Elite and the inventor of the entire space sim genre. I believe that he will be playing X4. Why not? I mean, it's a good game, right? Nova Normandy, welcome on board. Hello, hello. Don't, don't, don't shoot at me. 
I'm not shooting at you. You don't shoot at me. Okay. Okay, let's go. We, we can do it. Third, third try. <laughs> third try going through that damn gate. <laughs> Hey, Red Heart Wolf Drake, welcome on board. And you are absolutely right. And you get this, um, you get this message when you're buying Star Citizen. You get a like a big message. Entering hey, you're buying Star something seven. that is, you're buying something that is still work in progress. Uh, you can expect bugs, that issues and that issues and that issues. If you don't like it in 14 days, just give it back. Um, so that's something that they put into your face, like they 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 throw it at you. If you buy, uh, when you're buying it. And hey, I do have a referral code now if you want to use a referral code. <laughs> I know it's very early and I never even played it. But hey, there you go. That's that's my Star Citizen referral code if you want to use it. <laughs> it's even funny for myself. But I thought, ah, come on, just throw it in there. It's sitting there. Just let it sit there. Who cares? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know how many times my character stood up in bed and got stuck. Wow. So. Where do we need to go? Deploy satellites in specific area. But where? In 11th hour. Oh, we need to find the... Oh, wow. Uh, we need to find that. Actually... That... Hmm. Okay, let's give it a go. Good. Flight assist disabled. Ah, there it is. There's the gate. I see it. It's really sensitive. Still, it's it's so sensitive. This joystick. I think it's still too sensitive. Art. Way too sensitive. So we can see space operations data group soon in Star Citizen. <laughs> That's not on me. Backers of Star Citizen check. got a real citizen card. Interesting. I, I just, you know what? I wanted to get the game before anyone else get the username. <laughs> and um, I know that I will try it. Sooner or later. Entering system, 11th hour. Achieve coverage. Oh, it's that one again. Hey, stop. Stop your attack immediately. Um, so... But our new would stand more chance than you. Hello? Okay, safe. Wait, can I get out there with that? Oh yeah, cool. I can get out there. That's one. Screw that. You will now suffer the consequences. Hey, why? This is sector security. Comes channel open. 
Oh, against this station. Okay, you know what? Stop it. Just that satellite. Uh, let's go in here. You're going down. Autopilot engaged. Hmm. Back. Okay. I've had Star Citizen since the beginning. I have full lifetime insurance on my ship. Wow. That a lot. That's a lot. Autopilot disengaged. Okay, let's get out of here. Autopilot engaged. <clears throat> I do hope they add more cargo run options and salvaging sooner. I really want to play with salvaging mechanics. Oh, yeah. Personally, I'm more interested in Homeworld 3 than SC at this point. It doesn't bother me if they take another five years. Oof. Distant words, too. Autopilot disengaged. Okay. So this here first. Autopilot engaged. Uh oh. Okay. Autopilot disengaged. Um, there, 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 there. And the next one is then uh, here. Autopilot, autopilot disengaged. Autopilot engaged. Good. Well, maybe in the future it could be a Microsoft freelancer too. Hmm. We should visit her Quas C today. Maybe. Autopilot disengaged. What's my active mission at the moment? Yeah, exactly. So the only thing that matters is the 2D coverage. Uh, 3D coverage doesn't matter at all. Good, got that. Um, next one is... Here, I guess. Autopilot engaged. Good. So far, I start to get the grip of it. So far. Once DCS Apache module is out, though, I fully expect to lose my life and have to apply to the US Army for a job. Autopilot <laughs> what? disengaged. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Eat plasma. Eat plasma. Okay, that worked there. Um, next one will be in here. Autopilot engaged. Well, what was that? A proper 3D overlay on the X4 map? Wait, what? A 3D overlay on the X4 map? Where? This one here. Or do you mean from the from the mission? 
Autopilot. That one here. Disengage. Yeah, that's a 3D thing here. But it's completely nonsense. Because the only thing that they want to have you covered is the 2D area. So whatever they show you there is complete nonsense. At least for this mission. 86. Okay, and now we're now we're starting to get into a very Ah. Uh... Ah, uh, that's bad. Okay, let's let's go there. Autopilot engaged. There are already satellites. Wait, they're putting satellites next to my satellites? I don't get it. You place them too close to the center, maybe? Hmm. No, no, that's fine. We're still, we're still just having 86% coverage of that area. And we, we need oh, 95. Pilot. Disengaged. Ninety-one. Ah, Ninety-one coverage. Um, so let's drop one there, and that should be the last one. Autopilot engaged. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, satellites to finish the mission. Argon Federation unauthorized kill, but from where? Unauthorized kill, Argon Federation. that it has to be them I mean it cannot be someone else can it it cannot be someone else it has to be them I mean the Argons are not flying in here they're not insane and that's why station security is always like maybe the um Attack all enemies, still defend. Maybe they're docked and they're uh, flying in there. Mm hmm. And the next thing you know is they're shooting everyone that's that's flying into this uh, into this dock. Fucking wait. Ah! <gasps> Look at that! The symbol changed. We can build ships on this thing now. What? I cannot do minimum preset. I do not have engines. I do not have thrusters. What? <laughs> we're we're missing engines and thrusters. Yeah, <laughs> not a single engine, not a single thruster. Ah. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. I, I, I guess we need to get, we need to get some stuff first. <laughs> uh, I always use advanced satellite in that mission. Seventy percent of the time, one is enough. I guess so, but they cost so much. Maybe the turrets are shooting while they're docked. Exactly. Weapons, shields. Weapons and shields, uh, we have them already. Because of uh, building stations. Um, with turrets and, and shields, we have that already. 
Maybe the wharf's turret behavior is overwriting your own ship, so even when they're set to defend, they start to shoot. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Disengage. Okay. Oh, come on. 94. <sighs> one percent coverage. We're missing one single percent Auto coverage. Engage. Where's my... Where's my stream? There's my stream. Autopilot disengaged. Great work. Great work. What do we got to do now? 700,000 payment. Nice. What's the next mission? Hello? Mission? Wait, that was it? <laughs> Great work. Um, Split attack station. Combat supplies, hunting down Argon ships, assemble fleet. Not really. Yeah. Not really. Uh, let's go back to business. Let me see something really quick. <sighs> that takes forever. Forever. Um Let's go and grab some. Oops. Let's go and grab some uh, satellites. Because I'm running out of satellites. And I want to fly there by myself. Let's go. Boosty boost. We need more credits. <laughs> we need more credits. That's true. Um, but we also need more. Blueprints. We need them blueprints. And the only way to get them blueprints is to fly back, right? This will be interesting. Oops. Yeah, we're doing a flyby. Try talking less. You might fly better. Oh my god. Uh, almost. Ooh, that was close. Entering system. Ooh, Fire that was close. <laughs> oh my. Stream sniping NPC. <gasps> Damn it. It's always weird because when you're in um, in travel mode. I actually, in, tr in travel mode, I want to have that thing completely 
at the back because when I go out of travel mode, um, I want to stop immediately. And when you're not, when you're not having the throttle completely back, you're you're still flying, and you're wondering why you're not stopping. It's weird. Maybe there are also some other issues with, but I don't know why we're not stopping sometimes when we're getting out of travel mode. Maybe it's just because of the inertia Entering of that thing here. But I don't know. Could be, could be not. Smart chip factory. Split wharf. There you go. X4 Foundation Tokyo Drift. <laughs> Is that? And then if you know, if you live in Tokyo. <laughs> I don't know. Uh oh. Ah! See, that's what I mean. I don't know why we're not stopping. No clue. Hello. My goodness. Katana is hard to fly with with the Hotos. Split wharf. Wharf. Docking granted. Thank you. Oh. Okay. I think the flying it assist is not working we, we like with gamepad and mouse. Successfully docked. Was thinking of commenting it, but I talked too much already. We are pleased <laughs> to welcome you aboard. <laughs> oh, Vumara, Vumara. No need to hold back yourself. Uh, let's get some satellites. Requesting permission to dock. Get some advanced satellites Docking just in case. Green. If we get one of these missions again. Ah, that is some money, but I don't care. Uh, can we do... Wait, can we do something else? Crew? Let's get some service crew. And uh, that's it, apparently. There is a scheduled upgrade for this ship. Are they missing resources? Did I... They're missing advanced satellites, right? Uh, advanced electronics. Oh, they're missing advanced electronics. But that's no problem because I wanted to jump into another system. No! <laughs> not possible uh rep here i need you in two grand here somewhere blind wait <clears throat> now i can also fly there by myself Entering Zyoth's Dominion 1. Entering Zyoth's Dominion Oh, 10. that's the... That's the rep here. That's why the cockpit looks so weird. Anyway. Yeah, resources are missing, but that's no, no problem. I'm still waiting for this one here to finish. And we need to go to the faction representative. Uh, to get blueprints for the serial peacemaker. <laughs> Is that already built 100%? Everything's fine and built. Yay! Boop, boop. Perfect. Oh. Cool.
That's the fabrication bay. That's the maintenance bay. Uh, I could now get rid of the maintenance bay, right? At first I hated the repair, but now I somehow Entering like it. I even built a few additional of them for exploration. Four. Remember to add construction drones to speed up the ship production a small bit. Really? Construction drones to speed uh, Really? We have cargo drones. Building drones. Okay, I mean, 50? You can also do some more cargo drones. 50, even 60. Entering system, open market. Repair drones. 40. Building drones are for ships. Let's make 80. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> Captain Aaron, welcome on board. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Hello, hello. Okay. Hmm. That's that. Entering system. Two grand. So, um. Again. Maintenance bay. We can get rid of that. Can we? Last audio token. <gasps> no! No! Don't you have 10,000 points for watching? And you spent them? 10k points. Um, I would like to get rid of that. Remove. But you have 80 drones, you need to recycle 40 of them first. I'll spend it all. What? So wait, uh, fabrication bay holds drones. If we don't have that anymore, we're not having the drones. Drones are housed in docks. Hmm. Next thing I want to build is the L fabrication bay, and this needs to go in here. Needs to go in here. Hmm. Hmm. Container storage. There's just a single container storage. A single container storage is also not enough, you know. Estimated price to buy all resources zero? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Um Hey. Teleport. Entering system. Grand exchange. Entering system, Sol. Entering Saturn One. Ah, uh, yes.
There you go, by the way. If you ever... Uh, if you ever wanted to see how many FPS I'm running, lower right corner is very small, but it's there. 40 FPS at the moment. Wow. You can just remove it without removing drones, but you will waste some materials. Zero. You killed your maintenance dog, so the money gained is used in building the other stuff. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, recycle. Oh, nice. I like recycling. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Najima. Honor to see you here. Hi. Uh, we need some blueprints for stuff like engines. <laughs> Engines would be a good start, you know. Um, let's get all the Mark 1s first. Mark 1, Mark 1, Mark 1. Good. And give me the Mark 2, I think. 2. All around combat. Shovel. All around combat, travel. Oh, that's already a lot. And thrusters. Ooh. Uh. 12 million. But yeah, that that's that's how it is, right? Got all the drones. We got all this one. No, we didn't get this too. Why not? Countermeasures. Okay. Missiles. All of them. Thrusters. We'll get the next ones. We got the engines. We have some shield generators already. Get this one too. Uh, can we do that one? I think we can. But let's see if we have some weapons that we need to do to take. Um, S tracking, we can take this one. Terran M Proton Barrage. Oh yeah, that would be nice. Terran S Proton Barrage. Huh? That costs more than the... Okay, well. I see. Um, We still got a million something. Dumpfire Launcher. I think that's something that the NPCs like. Pulse Lasers. Dumpfire Launcher Mark II, select that one. Confirm. Good luck out there. Good. So, we're building ships now. Operating budget is not that high. Huh. Okay, but can we can we now build a ship? High preset ship. Yeah. It works. We have all the stuff. Okay. Okay. Good. 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 Seems like we have our first uh our first shipyard that's running. 300,000 credits left. Oh, well. Oh, that's just that. And uh, what about the Cobra? Can we have more? Ah, oh, we're missing some, huh? Cancel that order. Ooh, what's that? 
Oh, that's too far. Is it? I guess it's too far. What if we sell it here? Oh, we cannot sell it there. Damn it. We cannot sell it there. We have to sell it here. There is no other way. There you go. Confirm. Confirm. Nice. Rapier. Oh. Docking granted. Oh, boosting does not work in here. Well, well, well. Oh. Docking aborted. Hey, amended man, welcome on board. How are you liking flying with the Hotas? So far, so good. It's. I'm still not used to it, but it's fine. It's really fine. Oh no, wait. What's going here? Ow. Give me a second, please. Um, Oh man, okay. <clears throat> Does it make you feel like a pilot? Uh, it just make me feel completely confused sometimes. Um... Sorry, bah, stuff that I need to that I need to care about. You get over that muscle memory takes a little time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, <clears throat> uh, that system here is is in this room since two weeks, but it's the first time ever I'm using it to play something. So before that, I just did the video with it, but I had no actual time to um, to play it. And that's something that I need to do right now. Answer. Oh my goodness. Are you still? No, oh my goodness. Okay. Well, yeah. Stop that. <laughs> the repair is still trying to fight someone without um, even having a, a weapon on board. Hey, Chris. Welcome on board. Still have the urge to say Carlos. I don't know. That will not go away that 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 soon. 
Okay. Good, that happened. 6.8 million. Come back. Dock and wait. So, Sita's fine now. Okinawa Orbital Supply Base. Exactly. Out of docking range. Out of docking range. Out of docking range. Docking granted. Aha. There you go. And I still feel it's too sensitive. I don't know. It, it still feels extremely sensitive. Ah, maybe that maybe that's not right. It still feels extremely sensitive. Oh, that's first person look. Ah. First person look sensitivity. That's not what I wanted. Um Wait, there's just first person direct mouse steering. That's the sensitivity there. Is there like software for that thing to change the sensitivity? Like I said, I'm I'm not uh I have not tried to play it drivers software target software game settings mapping example mapping example hotas elite dangerous elite dangerous war thunder ace combat elite dangerous everspace mech warrior star citizen there is no x4 Hmm. Hmm. Uh, what is this? What is what is target software? Driver package and firmware. I'm downloading everything. I don't care. <clears throat> oh, you're writing so much. Uh, just remember, Captain, using it now is good practice for Star Citizen. <laughs> Ramming speed. Uh, did you see the small improvement to the HUD for the resource probe? Yes, I saw that picture in uh, Discord. Chorus. <laughs> exactly. The probe UI is going to take some getting used to, but I really like it. It's Kamikaze repair. <laughs> Don't be afraid to visit, re revisit the keybinds as you get used to it and fly with it a while. Oh yeah, I would do that constantly, I guess. It's a bit chunky and dominates too much of the map, but that's the case with every UI element of the map. <laughs> uh, don't you have a sense key on the joy? No, I don't. I have one on the mouse. It's very easy and it makes different colors. Look at that. Can you see that? Different colors. That's very easy. Oh. But it's there's no one on the joystick. You may need to use the external software to change the curve. You can set up a target profile and adjust the curves on the stick and then have it auto load when you run X4. Wow. There is no X4. Cancel that company. <laughs> Where's my Twitter? That no, the, the that was the other the other thought. There is no X4, uh, the, so there is no X4 mapping. I could put one there. <laughs> I could put a X4 mapping in here, game setting. Um, and have also my name written there, like for example, the ma mapping example by Commander Amerix. Look, like that's the YouTube guy. Mapping example by Commander Amerix and stuff like that. I can do that too. Just just make my example 
put put my example in there and we're good sure why not i want a cool sheet <laughs> Give me the cool sheet. <laughs> I will get all the sheet. <laughs> uh, that sounds so horrible in my language. <laughs> Not only in yours. Okay. Um. So at the moment I can adjust it. You said... Basically, I can't adjust it. What is adaptive steering, by the way? What if I put that off? What does that change? Ah. Okay, wait, what? Stop. Identifying criminal vessels. On. <clears throat> There's just this dead zone, but dead zone is not sensitivity. Hmm. Okay. Well, well. Criminal vessels. Please assist in pursuit. It's mostly for gamepad users because of the limited access available. Oh, okay. I'll see. There way, that way. Ah. I don't have a fly backwards uh, button yet. Successfully docked. Get up. It's an honor to have you aboard. Thanks. Give me your blueprints. Give me them blueprints, all of them. It's an honor to see you. Hello. Uh, ships, S-class ships. Wow, they are expensive. <laughs> what? Oof. Um. Oof. What about weapons? <clears throat> Need a mining drill for myself. Huh. Mining turret. Yeah, we need that for the uh, M class, I guess. Turret. Oh, there is so much money that we need to spend still. I could spend money all day in here. Nimcha or Rapier? Nimcha or Rapier? Nimcha or Rapier? I think Nimcha, right? Think Nimcha. They're they're buying more Nimchas. Confirm. Good luck out there. Damn it. Just need to bind one to reverse the throttle. Oh yeah, I know. I don't bother with reverse thrust if I need to back up. I just nose down and use my vertical strafe. Ah, oh, that's a good idea. NPC says it's an honor to see you, and my brain is like, uh, did this uh, the cool sheets and Joyce nipple playing? <laughs> cookery? What is, what is, what is wrong with cookery? What is this one here? That's a hunch you. Okay, are you producing something? <gasps> oh, no, you're not. Damn it. Um. You're not 
building anything, do you? Expected operating budget 130 million. Yep. <laughs> nope. How about nope? Do they even buy from me there? I don't know if they even if if, if they even start buying stuff from me. Hmm. Good, yeah, confirm that. Uh... <laughs> Joystick buttons is usually before that. What? Oh! Oh, the... <laughs> the joystick button. Okay, wow, that, that was... Uh, that was... Around a few corners. Okay, teleport to that one. And we need to go into... Entering Jupiter. Rapier. Can I help? No. Sir. <laughs> Rebecca, please leave. Thanks. There you go. Good, 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 Rebecca. Um, What are the other stations are doing? What are they doing? Account management, transact, no, wait. Account management, yes. Um, where did you get the second credit from? Very interesting. Solar power plant is doing zero money at all. Micro lettuce, no money at all. The only one that's actually making money is the protein processing plant thanks silicon carbide is making no money at all confirm that you know what confirm that and where is Where is the silicon station? 21, you need 21 million and you just 136. I don't get it. Okay. <laughs> give me the, give me the credits back. Ah, wait, what? No. Confirm. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> hey the timeless gamer welcome back i can't get stations to ferry resources between each other even using the mule mods some resources just don't get moved uh did you have already time watching the latest youtube video Because I am uh, telling you how to do that with repeat orders. Maybe you want to have a look at that. It's very, very short. The uh, The amount of video that you need to watch is like just three minutes or so. Even even less. Just bad ice cream. And <laughs> okay. So. What else is doing? Wow. I heard an oh, that's 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 hard. Where do we got... 8 million from... Ah, oh, from the trade. Oh, yeah, right. I remember. Uh... 
let's go in here. That's still the best way to get some money very fast. Okay, Opera back to here, dock and wait. If you still have questions after that, uh, please feel free to uh, to 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 send them in Discord. Uh, it's very hard to answer stuff here, and in Discord you can send pictures and whatever of your settings and stuff. You know, uh, so uh, d deeper questions, uh, gameplay wise, are uh, better better placed in in Discord. We were hit. Okay. That's uh, I will say weird view. Oprah. By whom? Oh, Argon. Interesting. Oh wow. Uh oh. <laughs> huh. Pictures of Spider Man. <laughs> Deadless, thank you so much for the hydration. Cheers! It's so nice to not have to press shift anymore. Just pressing a button on uh, on your on your uh, throttle. Way easier than uh, before. Okay, and where is that dude? That dude is coming. Wiggling a little bit. Docking. Good. Thirty-four. <laughs> Just needs to mine 82 and he has got 34. 50 million credits. Good. Fifty million. And we're still not building any ships, do we? Not really. Where can I see that? I already forgot where you can see where ships are being built. That's so long ago that I forgot Entering how you see it. Saturn one. Yeah, running there with 45 frames. <laughs> Console frames. <laughs> 37. Wow. It's an honor to see you here. Okay. Let me buy some ships, lady. Oh, the Baldrick, huh? Boom. Boom. <gasps> I can still buy it. Oh, yeah, nice. Confirm. Good luck out there. It's an honor to see Ooh, you. Ooh, cool. All oh, the S-ships owned. Nice. Uh, the M-class utility ships are bought. That's, what is it? Uh, 48, 58, 65, so 66 million. Basically. No, it's a little bit more. 67 million. 67 million we need to make. And that is our goal. 261 million. Uh, we still have some money left. What could we buy with it? Turrets? Eh. Shield? Eh. Engines? Eh. <laughs> Anything? Oh my god. The rest, we have the rest.
Okay. Good luck out there. Thank you. Got the bald Rick. <laughs> Entering Jupiter. <laughs> the bald Rick from Rick and Morty, huh? So. Why are we not building ships? Do we have a ship trader? Yes, we have a ship trader. Okay. We have a manager. Can I help? I cannot give you a seminar. A two star Over seminar. Now. Okay, interesting. Does he need that operating budget? I don't think so. I mean, we're providing, we're providing everything on that station. So even if I would like to build a new ship, let's say I want to build a Baldrick with high preset, I could build it at the moment. There is no warning. An S-Class Gladius high preset? You could build that. No warning. You shouldn't care about budget. Okay, selling advanced satellites is really a great money maker. It is, but it all, it's also uh, a manual trait and I want to remove as much manual traits as I can. I would actually like to have the uh, this shipyard just building ships. It's not building anything. Are you selling ships to everyone? Um, yes. Global settings. No restriction. Yes, what does the logical overview tell? Look at the logical overview. I guess no demand. Hmm. Sell ships manually. Oh my god, look at that. What the heck is going on here? Look at the top. What? Oh, this was... Oh, because... Okay, weird. <laughs> weird. Hmm... We're building crocs, minimum preset. How many can we build? Five, six, twenty, seventy. It doesn't say. It doesn't give me. It doesn't give me a warning. Ah! 
Now it gives me a warning. <laughs> Is there another shipyard in vicinity? Um, in Mars. Okay, it it okay. I just wanted to check if it if it gives you a warning or not. Great, great video. I'm building that setup right now. So, yeah. Glad to hear. Glad to hear. Thank you so much for the kind words. Yeah, um... That was something that we, um... That we tried and... And proof saved the last time. The last stream. So, this stuff is happening on stream. Um, at least the... The, uh, the, um... Uh, the planning and the execution and everything is is happening on stream and then I try to condense it into a video that's very short and and useful for you to use um so that you don't need to watch hours of streams just to get the the um important information <laughs> hey sky serum what are you uh, walk on board what are you planning to do with those frogs I will flood the Terran market with them Science experiments. <laughs> we're putting bombs on them and then we're sending in it. Uh, then we're sending them to our colony and then we're um, trying to destroy all of them with uh, tornadoes. Sorry, that, that was a referral to yesterday. A <laughs> world yesterday. <laughs> a frog invasion army with minimal settings and everything. It's just to distract fire. I mean, we take the sin and we invade the Argons and then we let 100 frogs fly around us just as a distraction so that nobody will shoot the sin. <laughs> Looked at the dog ships going up. Oh yeah, true. Look at the uh, property owned list. <laughs> that looks like the, it looks like the boom rat list from yesterday <laughs> oh we're done oh nice <laughs> we have every single letter here a b c d e f g h i J K H L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Everything. Everything's there. Boom. One hundred of them. Oh, that doesn't work. One hundred of them. Sold to the Terrans. Every single one is 240,000 credits. Wow, that's even better than selling advanced satellites. <laughs> okay. We're going up from half a million credits in the bank account. Top left corner to... Boom! 24 million! <laughs> what are they doing now? Are they flying off? Or... <laughs> Ah, uh, get out of Sita. Hey. 
Get out of Sita. Oh my god. Oh wait. Wait. <laughs> if they are. Ah, uh, stop. Oh my. <laughs> Look at that. Frog. Frog, 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 fr
as they switch. Wow, that, wow. Okay, wow. December 2021. Ah, uh, I'm not lucky enough to be as, as, as big as a streamer until then, so that they sent me one. <laughs> oh well, here we go. Here we go. We got 100 copies to flood the market. Oh, they're not that... Oh, they're not that expensive. Damn it. Here they come. They did the Steam Link box for a while. They cancelled it. Basically, it's an even bigger Steam control with a screen. Still trying to make a gyro control. Thing. Does it, is that a PC? Is there a PC inside so you can play the games? Or do you still need a PC to play these games? So it's, it's just like... An external device. Here they come. It's Copus time. <laughs> Look at that. Copus, 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 Mineral, Copus, 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 Mineral, Copus, 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 Mineral. <laughs> A constant flow of copus. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> wow. Great. Great work. Like a parade. Or like the Tour de France. <laughs> Just in space. Tour de space. It's a standalone? Wow. Wait, wait, wait. Are the games streamed? That looked like a plane snake in space. <laughs> Astro train. <laughs> yeah. You can play games without network. How much credits do you have now? Uh, 39 million. That was fast, right? So, what is the next thing that we could build? Repairs. <laughs> Sir, I want to buy a ship at your station. Sorry, I just I just sell them in 100 bulk. You you can only buy 100. <laughs> Minim, minimum quantity 100. <laughs> That's a laddie somewhere is foaming up. <laughs> He's like profits. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Look at that insanity. Hey, you know what? Let's have Entering. a look. Entering. <laughs> That's it. That's it. <laughs> Entering. <laughs> oh, wow. 100 ships. Oof. Hey, Kajar. Welcome on board, Captain Sirius. Hello, hello, hello. Weekend hype. Nice. Exactly. For me. For you too. You start your week also on Sundays. <laughs> hey, Sheldy. Welcome on board. The symbolizer. Hey, welcome on board. <laughs> wow. What is going on? Where are you coming off from? Cheers. 
Hey, hey, hey. Wow, that takes some time, huh? The 200 extra ships is is a lot to save. This autosave is brutal. Yeah, this one is really brutal. That reminds me of the autosaves before version 4 and before 5800X. Have a nice weekend. Oh, it's Thursday. <laughs> when do you start your weekends? Come on. Or, or do you all have a, a half day tomorrow? Hello, autosave. Hello? game so for some reason i have been thinking about a big old ui overhaul for x4 and i think that i got uh, a lot easier to mention band <laughs> i okay interesting do you have a saturn do you have a uh, direct connection to Bernd? oh my god look at that uh, look at that Whoa! Whoa! What's going on? They were put into internal storage. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Look at that. And the traders are coming in and and trading and trading and trading, huh? Wish we could tell if it froze. <laughs> it didn't froze. It's nice to have weekend from Thursday till Monday. You have weekend from Thursday till Monday? Wow. Well, I keep saying to email him if we got something, so... Ah, I kind of wish we had more of an effect for building ships like the Supreme Command lasers. Oh well. Next one done. Next one, next one, next one. Next one. On the other side? Not really. And now? Go away! Go away! Oh. On the other side, the same. Look at that. Now put them into storage. Goodbye. Wow. <laughs> and the next one. And here they start to build the next... <laughs> That's an order, huh? Wow. And <laughs> be free, repairs. Free. No, they're not done. There's still a lot more. 48 still. To, 48 to go. <laughs> 48 to go. But this time I will do something really nice. Okay, let's let's do that. Entering Jupiter. What's weird right is that you can't you can't use the mouse button. That's that's somehow weird. I, I cannot I cannot sit down there because there's no button to sit down. Well, okay, that was docking. I can't do everything with with the hotels. Not not needing to to do anything, but I cannot. This is just the options menu. 
jumping. Wow. Yeah, there is no action hotkey. That's the problem. Hello there. Yellow alert. Kalen underscore Tigress is now hosting space operations Delta with two viewers. Kalen, welcome on board. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing good. And uh, we'll be waiting until these are done. And then I will show you a nice little uh, opera. Yeah, that will look interesting. <clears> hey, <throat> Doc Baguette, welcome on board. I'm able to do it with my... I think I have set it to whichever command has the default hotkey F. Whichever has the default hotkey F. Uh, wait, is it platform movement? No. Uh, general. F. F. Interaction menu. Oh. But if I... Yeah, that doesn't work. Oh, I'll cancel. Um, but I could use this one here. Okay. Let's see if it works. Get up. Hello. Go back. Oh, still in Sita, huh? Wait, no. Oh yeah, that works. Thank you. Amazing. Okay, cool. Now that button is also on. On here. Very nice. I didn't knew that it was F. I was always trying to to find the button for um for left left mouse button, you know. Good. And now Let me show you Entering Saturn. Let me show you a theater. That way. There's a key for you use general. I think I'm not one sure. Okay. How do you keep doing the Sita while standing buck every time? Um The Sita runs. So while running Sita, I just open the menu, the interaction menu, this one here, and get up. And that's it. And Sita runs. You can see that without being in the pilot seat now. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, it's not designed to do it like that. <laughs> okay, let me show you a nice opera. Let's go. Repair. Oh, we still. Oh, there are a few repairs that are. Oops. There are a few repairs that are actually doing stuff for me. Uh, I need to be sure that I don't sell them. There is one in two grand, which I don't want to sell. Then the, this one in Jupiter. And this one here. Yeah, so that should be a hundred. Oh, uh, that's okay. Okay, okay. So frogs... Frogs are a good value. Frogs are definitely a good value. And let's have a look. That would be interesting. Goodbye, my friends. <laughs> oh my. What the heck? Uh oh. Uh oh. This will be game breaking. Just look, this will be great game breaking, I guess. Oh my goodness. Uh oh. Oh wow. Oh, oh okay, okay. Um <clears throat> 
Just right right before we break the game. <laughs> Game is cursed. <laughs> Space bullet time. Yo, go. Yips. Oh, ah. Uh. I mean, I don't care if they, if they getting destroyed because oh my goodness what is going on here woo woo yay <laughs> ever saw 100 repairs in one single docking bay well every single time something new huh <laughs> <laughs> Every stream you get to see something new. That's so nice. Okay, what are you trying here? What is going on with you? Oh, you're oh 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 ah! <laughs> Don't destroy my my Baldrix. There's the next one. Yo. Meow. <laughs> Is that it? I think that's it. Okay. All of them are... All of them are out. And here they fly off. <laughs> Nice. So 15 copies, 17 repairs, and 23 frogs? What do you mean? Imagine being the poor fighter pilot coming in and all those spiders just start rising up. It's like, oh, oh no. Well, it cleared. Oh, there's still there's still one. You're the last one. Let's go. Oh no, there's still one more. Coming from the outside. Um, selling manual is way more efficient than selling auto. Yeah. Five hundred k. Yeah, that was the start. 24,039,56. But what do you mean with 15 copies, 17 repairs, and 25 throcks? Oh, K. 15K. No, 100. Wait, basically, that's 150,000, 170,000, 230,000. Oh, okay. Profit from 100. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, true, true, but the frogs are around um, 24, so uh, I can do something to take a look at. I think we should have done that before, so one minimum. We should have done that before, before we started to, to make something really weird. Okay, there, Nimcha, Repair, Minimum, Copis, Minimum, Rock, Minimum, Confirm Order. They're all being built here, right? Good. Pizza ad in the station. Uh, we could also try to do this here. Slice Baldrick. 
Da ist ein Bolo. Bolo Gas. Confirm that too. No, you also got some M-Class ships. Which are being built. Yeah. Here they are. Oh, hey, wait. There is one more. Or is that just... Oh, no. They're landing there. Okay, landing lights are on. Yeah. <clears throat> Does the AI actually use all those ships? Like, if you build one of frogs, will they do anything? I don't know. Um, in... In past versions, I saw that they were just disappearing. Entering Jupiter. Uh, I saw uh, sometimes that they were Hello just there. disappearing. But now, I don't know, because they flew away. Uh, no idea if they're using now the frogs or if they just... Oh my god. Cookery. I did not... I did not bought these cookeries. Oh, okay. There's the carrier. Rapier. Here are the rapiers. It seems like they're docking and since the dock ship's number is going down, Sometimes... Maybe they are deconstructing them? See, the number is going down. I think they are docking there and they get deconstructed. So... You are not selling them ships at the end. You are just selling them resources. Hey, what was that? What the heck? Are you kidding me? What was that? <clears throat> they will deconstruct them and use the resource. Ah, yeah, there you go, guys. <laughs> Cap going all capitalism. You have the purple cockpit for Bordrix in the fitting window, too. I don't know. But Microsoft did mention that the civilian credits are separate to the military credits, so I guess one space credit is one million civilian credits. The galaxy is not ready for that. <laughs> And if you build them from Terran materials, they will get deconstructed in universal components. So ships are basically the world's most pointless delivery system. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Okay, so. Um, they should be done. All of them. And they sit in Saturn 1. Rock, Gladius, Copius, Kukri, Nimcha. Saturn. Uh, that's it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six S class and three M class. Okay. So, if you want to have all the values, oops. If you want to have the values, there you go. Screenshot it. Maybe I do a screenshot myself. There you go. Hey, that's actually a pretty good... Um, that is actually a pretty good uh, picture for uh, Instagram. Okay. Um, being the best one in here is the Baldrick 600k. And now we need to see how much resources we need to uh, to produce that. Gladius, Bolo, Baldrick is of course the uh, the highest amount. Okay, sell that. Sixty million. Good. Hmm. Um, 
God damn it. I put that in here. Ah, yeah, there. That's the one that I need. Nice. the cooker is almost the most expensive one oof <laughs> doesn't the values vary by the economical state of the game yeah that's true but the um how do i say that so if the value changes all the value changes and um if one ship is more expensive than the other that will stay the same but the value can change so if one is more expensive then the other, if the value changes, all of them will change, you know. I don't know how how else to say that. But the, one one ship will not get more expensive because the economy is changing. That doesn't happen. Just finished watching the new trading station video. Uh, it made me realize that I do not actually use repeat orders anymore. <gasps> oh no. I feel a video coming about profitable ship selling. Let me grab my uh, small thingy here. Uh, X4. You know what? That's that's not a bad idea. Selling ships for profit. You can't really read it, but you can see the, all the S's. It's profits. That's a to-do task. Nice. I love that. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I made a cameo on Steam. On Cap Steam. Wait, what? You did what? Oh, the frogs made me rich. <laughs> oh, that's even a good... Oh, wow. That's that's uh, a good thumbnail. That's a good thumbnail. Right next to it. Let's go. Ideas over ideas. Thank you. <laughs> Most important tool the captain has. Pen and paper. That's true. And uh, no, actually, pen and paper is the second most important thing. The absolute most important thing um, is uh, if you take a look into the mirror. I don't have a, I don't have a sound for that, but oh, Captain, where do you want me to tell you that what cookery actually means? Shall I steam it to you? <laughs> it's fine. Damn, that was deep. Uh, are we tools to you? No. More precious than tools. Wait, did you just call yourself a tool? Can we please have a, a tool? Who said a tool? Wait, what? What? What is going on here? Why are we watching at a pause screen? Um...
what was the next thing that I wanted to do? Ah, yeah. Um, looking up the materials that you need to... Uh, that you need to put into these ships. Okay, let's see. A baldric in um, relation to a... Let's say in relation to a frog, okay? So a baldric does need... Here. 17 computronic substrate, 157 energy cells, and 72 metallic microlattice. That thing is about... 2.5 times the value than a frog. And a frog needs... 7 computronic substrate. 51 energy cells and 23 metallic microlattice. Okay, well, um... Let's... Grab a... Editor. Seven times CS fifty one EC twenty three. Oops, MM. Okay, in comparison to Audric, Audric is seventeen times. 157 times. 72 times. And the prices are... On the market... Computronic substrate. Energy cells. Take my list. Prices are, let's say, eight. Uh, eight thousand thirty and forty seven. That means this one here costs. Let's see. Um, 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 um. Seven times eighty-three. Damn it. Um, memory clear. Fifty-one times eight. Memory plus twenty-two times forty-seven. Fifty-seven thousand six hundred ninety-nine, and the other one costs seventeen times eight uh, three is very clear. Stop. Oops. Stop. Uh, one hundred and fifty-seven times eight, and seventy-two times forty-seven. 141.150. Okay, and we sold them for... Oops. Ah! Damn you, Windows! That's how you play X4. <laughs> uh, we sold them for 243.716 and 614.306. That means your profit is. Wait, uh, there you go. 422% uh, profit 
And this one here is 614. Divided by uh, four, four, five. Huh! Look at that! Interesting. You play X4 by using Excel. Yeah, that's true. That's cool. That's a frog. And that's a baldric. There you go. Huh. Get that it wasn't meant like that. Just seemed funny. Cool. Or was the best effect completely out. Why did you take one price from bought and two from sold? I don't know. Because it felt more right. I know that I can get uh, energy cells for eight. If you usually buy a uh, computronic substrate, it costs you eight, 8,000 something. And metallic micro lettuce is whatever. That's just 10, 10 credits difference. Someone know if the kids these days still have to use the real calculating class or do they all use their smartphones? I don't know. I wait. I, I think I wait until your stream is done for today before I steam you the... Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. So I'm not that much shocked. Frog is still good. But if you have the materials, then go for Baldrics. Because if you, if you build 100 Baldrics... You do this, uh, you, you can get the same percent of profit, almost, a little bit more. But you sell a lot more, a lot more, um, vo like, you sell it for a lot more credits, and it's about two, two and a half times more worth than a frog so basically if you sell 100 baldrics you're selling almost the equivalent of 250 maybe even close to 300 frogs that's not bad i'll save that I'll save that. Maybe use that in the YouTube video. Yeah. Just create a spreadsheet to quickly calculate that. Total profit is higher. This really is turning into EVE offline. <laughs> what if you use standard materials instead of Terran materials and sell hop ships or split ships? I don't know. No clue. Oh yeah, I, I got sold and bought wares. Yeah. But that's way more accurate. The 8,000 is way more accurate than uh, the other one. Anyway. Excuse me, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is that? Is that from a mission? <laughs> the advanced tinfoil satellite satellite <laughs> what excuse me what is this <laughs> then you have to calculate build time though with Sita that doesn't really matter yeah with Sita that doesn't really matter that's true I'm I mean that's true if you take in uh, the build time I mean, nobody does that in X4 because you have Sita and it's not real time. But if you would count in the build time, um, a Baldrick takes five times longer to build. So you could build more. Oh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. If you're out of system, you could build more uh, frogs in the same time. Five times more the frogs. And that means you would have double the amount of profit 
almost double the amount of profit from frogs. Oh my god, I don't know if I want to do a video about that. Oof. <laughs> it's like, wow. Um, oof. I get hated for that. <laughs> hey, Bubba Feet, welcome on board. Best seller materials, secret tinfoil material. <laughs> Can build frogs and Beldricks at the same time since different dogs. That's true. Two minute video. <laughs> I wanted to share something with you, but it's way too complicated. Just build your own ships on your on your wharf and sell them to other stations. That's it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Kept cons. See you soon. <laughs> That's it. That was the video. I I can make at least a uh, Instagram short out of it. Five times the frog reminds me of sixteen times the detail. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> So, build chips. <laughs> now that we know, what are we building? Now that we know, what are we building? Uh, cookeries, maybe. Nimchas, bolo, minerals, cookeries. Let's build some cookeries. Let's go. Cookery, minimum. Can we do a hundred? Yes, we can do a hundred. <laughs> Let's go. Build ships. We can still build M-class ships, right? Baldrick's. Minimum. How much can we build? 13? 40? Damn it. 30? Uh, 20? Okay, 20. Confirm. Nice. Even better. Hey, B Trent, welcome on board. Where is everything? There you go. <laughs> Why are the Baldrics not being built? What's going on? Can you only do six, eight, eight at a time? No. Oh, the Baldrick is 10 minutes, so you can build 10 times the frogs in the same time. Not even 5 times, it's 10 times. But now it doesn't matter. One thousand frogs, then you have them all undock and sell them while they're in space and watch the the wave cloud oh. <laughs> challenge conquer the entire galaxy using only frogs with mining laser no it's called copus but it is really just a frog i wonder just how many you would need to destroy something out of system <laughs> nice Wait, they changed it. You used to be able to build both together. Yeah, it's not possible anymore. Oh. Or it's not possible. I don't know if it's anymore or if it's just not possible. <clears throat> yeah, it should have it. Exactly. 6 M class base, but uh, it's not building anything there. And it also has got a lot more. I mean, look at that. It has got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 18 S class. Um, 18 S class docking base, but it's only using 8. It could build. 18 S-Class ships and 6 
M class ships at the same time. More production docks. Yeah, we're building just a a, a second S and M class um, construction. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> why not? I'm right now building 120 ships. Can you even believe that? Yeah, you ever had 120 ships being being ordered? Oh, eight. 8M. Look at that. 8M and uh, 18S class. Yeah, I had. You had. Wow. Well, that is probably so it doesn't get stuck with a construction claiming a slot and thus not being able to accept other ships for docking. Kajar had 1K. 1K ships? Oof. Some people order more. <laughs> okay, wow. Interesting. Oh my goodness, look at that. So I think we will be able to get some more blueprints. I guess. Nice. Um, it's not possible. Okay, let's see. Please do not sell my two there. Oh, we could also sell them maybe here. Wait, wait, what what price do you do you sell? Therefore. 307 614. 307 614. Oh, that's the same. What if I sell you to <laughs> What if I sell you to the Tiladi? Oh! <gasps> The Taladi really want to have Terran ships, huh? That's about 5% more. 5%. Hey, Fjok, welcome on board. Or Fjok. Well, never even built my own wharf. <laughs> well, then, go for it. We made millions and millions and millions in just an hour. Let's visit her quasi see while they were being built. <laughs> I found a problem with your video. Those that do not have the patch that allows the buy amount to be higher than the sell amount can't do that setup. That's it. Aha. Thank you, Timeless Gamer. That was the reason why it worked now and it didn't work before with the mining and repeat orders. Interesting. That's also uh, where the comments are coming from. Oh, man. It was so natural for me that it worked that I didn't even question it. Now that you say it, that's absolutely true. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. Now that you say it, that's absolutely true. They just uh, changed it that you can they can buy more than I uh, know that you can sell more than buying. Yeah. Should add a big old note in the video explaining that it's new in 4.1. Yeah. Captain Betrenth, just gifted five subscriptions. Thank you so much, Betrenth. Thank you for. Five subscriptions, and I see a lot of, um, a lot of known names also. Thank you so much for making the crew bigger. Halbor! <laughs> there you go. Think YouTube might have a button for that? I don't know. I will have a look into that after, after the stream, but that's, thank you so much, Timeless Gamer. Extremely, extremely important notice. Need another post-it. 
Um... Buy amount higher than the sell amount. Buy and sell amount in 4.1 different. Thank you for that. No, I'm um, I'm putting post-its everywhere. Anyone anyone German in here? What's the what's the English name for Schnorren? Damn it. <laughs> scrounge. I scrounged them from my wife. <laughs> scrounge. Scrounge. I scrounged them from my wife. <laughs> Post-its. A lot of them. What? Captain. Important notice. Betranth. Cheer 2,100 bits. Thank you so much, Betranth. A lot of thumbs. I see a lot of thumbs there. <laughs> Thank you so much for that much bids. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. That's amazing. And for all the subs and for all the give uh, for all the bits, we're now making some bucks in the game. Thank you, Betrand, very much, very, very much appreciated. I hope you read my message in uh, Discord. <clears throat> Sell. Boom. That was forty-six million on the spot. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> sell, sell, sell. Mel must make profits. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Picture. Wait, what, is, what does that not work? Where's Steam? <laughs> Save that. Uh, carnage. <laughs> nice picture there. Good. So that uh, we got a hundred million credits. <laughs> Just out of nowhere. Basically out of nowhere. We have 106 million credits more than uh, an hour ago. In the announcement? No! A personal message. There you go. I felt <clears throat> so. Here, here's the thing. I felt a little bit disconnected with all of you lately. Um, that's not on you. That's absolutely on me. Um, I was. I. I felt that I was not. To what is going on here? A lot of people are here. You. You want some money from me? You know that I'm billionaire almost. <laughs> um, I felt a little bit disconnected with all of you, uh, especially in Discord. Discord disconnected, ha ha ha, and uh, I'm 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 trying to be more active there again, and also be in the uh, in the voice channels sometimes when I when I'm just sitting here. So whenever you see me in a voice channel, please be free to join. I'm there because I want to talk or I want to distract myself a little, or it's an whatever. Honor to see you here. So feel free to join me there. Please, I'm there because I'm. Uh, I want to be disconnected. Uh, dis disconnected. <laughs> yes, I want to be disconnected. I want to be. Uh, uh, I said it a few times. I forgot the word now. Oof, Fox, John, and Katana. Good luck out there. Nice. There you go. I send it 40 minutes before the end. Enjoy the kick. 
can blame me and Captain Revolt for all the talking. No, every name, that's nice. You keep the you keep the um Discord alive. Annoy the heck out of Captain Collins, Roger that. <laughs> Kajar, you're also one of the people that keep the Discord alive. Thank you so much. You want to be reconnected? Yes, I want to be reconnected. I'm glad I was not on Discord because trying to explain cookery is bad enough and typing is much <laughs> Where did you? Oh, in Steam. Ah! <laughs> I don't know why all these monitors where everything pops up. I have no clue. Hello there. Hello there. It's an honor to see <laughs> Everything you. just pops up wherever it wants. Sometimes it pops up here and you can see it, sometimes not. Well. Okay, so we got all the ships, S and M class ships. That's nice. So I can do the video for S and M class ships. Haha. <laughs> um, 40 million credits left. That's, oh my god, the Mason stream is expensive. I want to have the Proton Barrage because it's really, really cool. Best weapon in this game. Why is the S class Proton Barrage? More expensive than the M-Class Port and Barrage. I don't get it. I don't get it. Terran main battery. Yeah, we don't need this now. Uh, the pulse laser stuff here. <sighs> All the turrets. Yep. Shield generators. Uh, at least... M class. No, don't get that one. Just get that one. Uh, shields, engines. Mm -hmm. Oh God, so much money. Wow, <sighs> that's so much money. Money, money, money. Good luck out there. Whoa. Oof. Okay, and we're back to 1.4 million. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> I'm guessing everyone's going to rewatch the VOD just to see what action means. Hmm, no idea. The S Proton is about twice as expensive as the M Proton. Gotta spend money to make money. Mm. Time for more frogs. Let's go. Frog army. Can we build more than 100 frogs? <gasps> We're lacking computronic substrate. Oh no. Wait, 90? 80? 70? Thanks. Confirm order. <laughs> you need to build many frogs to earn enough money for the Asgard main gun. <laughs> so, wait, 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 wait. Okay, wait, wait. One of my best friends, we need music. One of my best friends does something that guys just try to do in real life. And one of my best friends is, or was, I have to say was, calculating everything that he bought in cheeseburgers. <laughs> Not kidding you. McDonald's cheeseburgers, one euro per piece. He didn't count in euros, he counted in cheeseburgers. <laughs> He's like, if I buy that game, I can eat 20 cheeseburgers for that. <laughs> right now, the same. If we're buying an Asgard, we need to sell 100 frogs for that. <laughs> 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 
a valid international index. Yeah, <laughs> see, it's it's universally uh, usable. You can use it everywhere. Everyone will understand you about the value of products. If you say that costs 50 cheeseburgers, I'm 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 not ready to buy that. <laughs> Captain Hart, I'm waiting. Ah, that's good. <laughs> American counting. <laughs> It was so easy, you know, one, one, one euro, one cheeseburger. You know what's cheesy? Um, cheesy is when you are, when, when you are, um, uh, demanding, demanding the same price, demanding, uh, um, uh, when you're charging the same price, oh, sorry, that, that's the word. When you're charging the same price for a cheeseburger and a hamburger, that's cheesy. What is that? Saroon, that was the wrong, I cannot, that's, what is this? <laughs> you need to post that on Discord, not here. <laughs> Captain, Grievous 666, just resubscribed. Continuing duty as Spaceman First Class. Hello, guys. Hello, Grievous. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's just for the that's it that's again for the Germans here. If you take a look into the Discord, Sarun just posted this for you. I mean for the English people it's cradle of humanity. <laughs> what is one X4 credits in Euro? I don't know. To grab everything from an Oscar, you can expect close to one billion in total cost. That's about one 17,600 frogs. How many cheeseburgers? <laughs> then you can calculate how much burgers for one Asker. <laughs> I would say one cheeseburger is maybe 10, 10 credits uh, in, in X4. Is that... Could that be? No, wait. A uh, frog would be very cheap. I think it's one to one. So a frog is two two hundred forty thousand euros. It's a little bit cheap, but it's fine. How many chicken nuggets? Oh wow! Uh, chicken nuggets with coupons or chicken nuggets without coupons? <laughs> Because with, with coupons, one chicken nugget is 25 cents. Without, it's more like 60. Meneke Hedens Vugge in Danish. Okay, wow. So 10 credits for a cheeseburger seems about right. I think so. we are still got 60, 36 frogs. Oof. Okay, so. Teleporting. Entering Jupiter. <gasps> Look at who arrived. Look at who arrived. <laughs> Hello. Hi, buddies. Cookery. <laughs> oh my god. If, if we jump in there and watch them land, that takes ages. That will take ages. It 
Look at that, standing in line and waiting for their turn, just like some good old British people. <laughs> good old British people waiting for the bus. Hey Merkman, welcome on board. If one chicken nugget is made from one chicken, how many chickens do you need? Wait. <laughs> Wasn't that Jedi Fallen Order game start? The scrap boys got a, a lot of work now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Dadless, thank you for the hydration. Cheers. Hmm. Uh, frog nuggets? Yikes. Okay, we have the next... No, we don't have the next uh, couple of frogs. Frog nuts. <laughs> now you're getting silly. Ugh, frog nuts. Frog nut nug? Wait, frog nuts, frog nuts, frog nuggets, frog nuts or frog nuts? Should stop right here, right there. <laughs> no, no, it's nuts, frog, frog nuts. <laughs> ah, that's not what I wanted. Okay, there you go. Uh, frogs. Sell them to whoever pays the most. 17 million. Oh, oops, 19 million. 19 million, just like that. Uh, logic overview. Wow, we're really low on computer and substrate. We need to wait a little bit until we can do that again. We're really, really low on that. Rockets. <laughs> Entering Saturn 1. Oh, I can't rename the shipyard. This, it has already a name. I will not remove a name uh, for that. I'm sorry. Crazy bastard. Is, uh, I'm sorry. If something already has got a name, I will not remove it. Uh, remove it. Hmm. Too bad. I know. There are a lot more stations to do so. There's. There's still the hat quarter. Make a new one. Yeah, just make a new one because I want to. Forget that the future will be grasshopper nuggets. Ah, yeah, ooh. the breeding ground. Oh, that's that's a really good name. Really, really good name. It's an honor to see you here. Hey, Najima, just bought uh, just brought some music. You fine with that? So production module. The next one. Oh no, not production. Build module. The next one is an L fabrication bay. Two hundred. 28. Oh, wait. We could... We could go right away for the XL. And skipping the L1. What do you get for the L1? Sin Osaka? I think we're skipping it for the XL. And then we're building Asgard. Asgard. Uh. Oh my goodness. <sighs> oh, that's XL. Yeah, I don't need that. I need I, I don't need XL shield generators now. L shield generator is also unnecessary. M shield generator. That's also X oh wait. I just went there. Uh Wow. 
What? Bro. Oh, so there. much money. Everything costs just so much money. Station doesn't doesn't do anything there. Operating budget is still not high enough. The budget but the budget should not really do anything. That shouldn't change anything. Is this? Oh, let's drop that stuff. Ah, that's so unnecessary. That was from a mission. And I already changed the mission. <sighs> no need for that anymore. But we still have here a lot of money waiting. Um, but we only need 185 hull parts. Let me give me some, give me some hull parts. Uh, H H H H. All parts. Hey, there you go. No! Ah! I hate it when you left click on something and it's just going away. All parts, right click. Uh, 185. Confirm. And then bring it here. Confirm. Cool, that will work out. And what's going on with the with the miner here? I mean, come on. Eighty. Oh, we need two more. Two more. Okay, we we we're we're going to do that right now. Um, there's a rapier waiting in Jupiter. That's the one in Jupiter, right? Yeah. Teleport to. While we're waiting, we also can... Entering Jupiter. Yep. While we're waiting, we also can... Dip, blah, we also can get more uh, ships running. Wait. Good. Uh, more ships... Minimum. Audrix, how many? 13? No, oh, that works. 17? That works. 20? Works. 30? Oh, 40? Ah, okay, 30. Some order. Uh, Crazy Bastardus, so. I will give you back the points. I will refund you the points. There you go. And uh, you can decide on whatever you want to do with it. Next. Having had a bunch flying around and kept any one myself, I'm underwhelming, but I'm kind of underwhelmed by the Oscar. The main beam is nice, but kind of overkill most of the time. It's only a huge armored gun. <laughs> I want to have one for station uh, destruction and um, when we're that far that we can build one and that we can also build Sins or maybe at least Osaka's, uh, we can finally invade the Argon. That's my that's my ultimate goal, that we can um, liberate the Argon systems, you know, that's that's my goal. We're liberating the Argon systems, I will uh, change the headquarters. 
and put it right into Argon Prime, maybe even here, and then destroy every single station that's around here. <laughs> so we, we lure all of the big ships into a fight right here, where the advanced satellite sits. We lure all the ships in here, and then we jump with the, uh, with the headquarter. If you start streaming X4 in the morning, Mr. Owen won't be able to catch the stream every now and then. Oh, yeah, that's true. That is true. Or, or even better. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on board. Or even better, error name. Owen could do it in his work time. <laughs> If he wants to check on something uh, in the game and he can't start it up himself or whatever, he just comes into the stream and, and, and asks other people about it. How about that? So yeah, uh, while we're a lot of people in here, um, thank you all for watching. Um, just do it like... Uh, we just saw. Hit the follow button if you have not followed the channel. Thank you so much for that. And the next thing is that I'm changing streaming times uh, from next week on. I will be streaming uh, in the afternoon and not in the evening of every day. Because um, that's just more healthy for my relationship. If I'm working the same time as my wife works, then we have three evenings for, us, uh, for ourselves. Or we can do whatever, whatever, working on YouTube or studying or working on Estrella, also a good thing. Uh, so that's why I'm changing streaming times from the next week and uh, we're starting at 12 p.m. We're going from 12 to 6 p.m. So it's not only changing streaming times, that's the bad thing, but the good thing is... Thank you so much for that. Just subscribed. Welcome to the new Spaceman. Barton! Thank you so much for the tier one subscription. Completely new. Thank you so much for that. Uh, yeah. So then let me just shout out Barton. If you if you are uh, new to the channel, just like Barton. Maybe he's new. I don't know. But he just followed. So do it like Barton. Follow the channel. Thank you so much. Um, that's for free. Subscription is not for free. But that's on top. <laughs> Thank you so much, Barton, for the tier one. And um, yeah, we're changing streaming times from 12 to 6 p.m. Um, so that my wife and I do have free evenings. And that is way more healthy for a relationship. If this streaming should um, go on longer than just a few months. And um, longer than all the bad stuff that's happening around the globe at the moment. So when everything comes back to normal or the new normal... Um, that will be sufficient enough to keep it going for years, maybe even. That's why we're changing. Starting from next week. Captain, Betranth, just gifted two subscriptions. Betranth, thank you so much for the two and crazy bastardus. Welcome to the crew. You got, you got um, recruited by Betranth. <laughs> thank you so much, Mr. Recruitment Officer. Exactly. Yeah, that's that's what will happen uh, starting Monday. Sunday, on the other hand, Captain's Coffee Table, still the same. Captain's Coffee Table, 6 p.m. evening, Central European time. We're drinking coffee, we're talking about games. Most likely we'll talk about X4 at least once. <laughs> and um, we'll see us there. So one stream in the evening, Sunday, all the other streams at afternoon 12 to 6 p.m so what i wanted to say is what i forgot that um on one hand maybe bad for some people but maybe for other people that's good changing the times on the other hand good for everyone stream times getting longer so i'm streaming two more hours a day uh, from four hours up to six hours a day that's that's a good one 
And uh, what did I want to do? Oh yeah, I wanted to sell board rigs. A bunch of board rigs. To the lizard people. Bye bye Baldrix, make me proud. Boom, 22 million. Just added a two on top. <laughs> uh, but that's not what I wanted to do. Captain Bartons, just gifted five subscriptions. Barton, thank you so much for five subscriptions. Being new to the channel and gifting out five, that's absolutely insane. Thank you so much. Thank you for that. <laughs> that help for the community. Making the crew bigger. Five new people. And there are still names that I remember in here. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness. What are you doing? Stop. Go back. Tra oh, wait. Yes. Transfer rares. Nivium. Confirm. Do it now. Welcome on board. Mine re no, no, no. Stop mining resources. Fly back. Bring it. Bring it back. Where, where, where is he? Bring it back. What just happened? Hey, Vulmada, thank you for the hydration. Cheers. Barton, thank you, thank you so much again for six subscriptions in total. Uh, I hope that I helped you with X4 through YouTube. And uh, that's a thank you for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Yes, finally! Finally! Teleportation range 3! Oh my goodness. Whew. The next thing will be... Terraforming. I've watched your videos on YouTube and they've helped me so much in enjoying the game. What, what do you say? Uh, um, is that right? Uh, wait a second. Captain, Betran, just gifted two subscriptions. Okay. And what did I wanted to say? Hajime mashita. That's something else. Anyway, thank you so much. Be Trent, another two. Thank you for 22 in total. You're crazy. Crazy. Did you just started a... You should just... Did I just hear the singer of the hot dog song? No. <laughs> not the hot dog and not the ketchup song. Nope. <laughs> I thought that you, you uh, started already something. A train or so. I heard the train, but maybe he stopped. Hmm. Ah, I'm waiting for the teleportation. That's so good. No trains. No, no trains. <laughs> Why no trains? No, no trains. No trains have left the station yet. Nada Tyuk Tyuk. <laughs> tyuk Tyuk. Just spaceships? Yeah. Space trains. Space trains like in Rick and Morty. Is someone watching Rick and Morty here? I just, uh, I just watched the fifth, four, four, is it fifth, fifth season finale? Yesterday also. Anyway. The Ladi has new bald baldics. <laughs> Leviathan is a big locomotive, just 18 kilometers. What? <laughs> I 
I saw once a train in in, in uh, Siberia that was never ending. The never ending train. That was that was whew, a long time ago. I need to rewatch and watch the newer seasons. <laughs> so nice. Now has a much larger range. Whoa! G three fifteen T five DD. Just gifted eight subscriptions. I hear it. I I hear it. Wait, I I hear it. Ah, oh, it's leaving. It's leaving. Oh my god, that was loud, huh? The train left the station. Thank you guys for eight. Some gifted subs, 18 in total. Thank you. Oh my god, eight gifted? You know how much that is? Thank you so much. Atlay on board now again. Blitzbune on board again. Oh, nice. Thank you so much. Is this a sub war now? Yes. Yes. I'm still waiting for the new Star Trek episodes. Oh. Oh my god. Siren, just gifted 10 subscriptions. <laughs> Trains rolling. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Uh, level 5. Are you kidding me? Thank you so much, Sarun, for 10. 10. Another 10. 63 total. Are you kidding me? This is. This is. I. Uh, oh my god. I can't tell you how. How good this is. In. 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 In, in this. In. In this. Time right now. Oof. Thank you. Thank you. Ear bled. <laughs> Ear bled. <laughs> my ears just said nope and walk off my hopefully you saw my previous message message. Um People like yourself are a gift to niche communities for games like this, your positive mindset and caring attitude, coupled with the ability to easy teach is beautiful to see with games. Thank you, Barton. Very kind message. I try I try to do exactly that in every single video. Be easy and also fast by teaching you something. Um, and I hope I teach you right. Uh, I'm sorry that I forgot to put in um, the last video that it's the beta 4.1. Very sorry about that. Um, but I will add that to the video somehow, maybe in the description or um, in the title. I think I will add it in the title. Long time ago, need to rewatch and watch the newer season. Oh, okay. Kajar! Bye! This is Subware now. <laughs> Ears went lit. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Oh my god, I I just found like my instance again. <laughs> ah, no, that's wait, wait, wait. That's not that's not that. That's the one that I was searching for. <laughs> What is that? Choo choo bitches. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> uh, Energize. <laughs> hey. Oh, wait. 
Can we now can we now talk with uh Boso? And oh my goodness, finally we can teleport everywhere. Oh, that took so long. That took way longer than it should. Because of the difficulty of Nvidia mining. Entering. May I have your attention? I would like to undertake an experiment replicating the conditions that brought this facility to this location. This is something we must do face to face. Ah, I need to allow that. Thank you, Avumada. <sighs> Uh, I discovered a early game credit generator, a huge solar power plant in Nopoleo's fortune. I put a level five manager in there and he sells power cells everywhere. That's a good thing. I always underrated power cells, but uh, energy cells, I always underrated energy cells, but you can actually sell them because not every single NPC station is building energy cells um, on them. So that's actually something you can you can sell pretty good. I never I never thought that um, energy cells sell really good because I just built them on every single station because you get energy cells for free on every station. Never had the, an issue with them, but the NPC stations are actually using them. Yeah, choo choo! Oh my goodness, toot toot! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Vumara. Awesome. Oh my goodness. I don't know if I can sleep tonight. Oh. Hey, does your equipment look better now? Dell, weird looking Dell Busta. Hey, Dell. I can see what's going on in your head. <laughs> and that was the sub rage. That was the sub rage for today. Yes. Thank you again so much. Oh, wait. Wrong button. The Zemo are coming for oh, us. Oh, wait. Wrong button. Me. Oh, wait. Wrong button. <laughs> Thank you so much. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> My son is 15 months old and he heard the train sound and her I heard choo choo from across. The <laughs> no way. <laughs> hey, wake up. I am. <laughs> Thank you, Symbolizer. Cheers. <laughs> That's so nice. <laughs> Hmm. I hope that he didn't hurt the last one. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I know that some of you are watching me on a big screen. Hi, big screen. I think that's like, that's like 50 centimeters if I do something like that. So welcome on board. See, I don't always say strange things. I can do serious also. <laughs> I know. I like his looks more than his old looks. <gasps> Heresy. That's that's how it feels to be Dell. If you're looking down on yourself, you see your jaw. Hi, I'm Dell. That's all I do standing in here. I have a cool uniform. That's it. Can't see my shoes. Not that fat. Then I have a cool belt. Oh, damn. Oh, 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 oh. <clears throat> Hello there. Hello there. Stop harassing, Dell. Most YouTubers are watched at 65 inch. Looks awesome.
like Shaggy, it wasn't me. So when can we expect an official Captain Con's character in X4 with voiceovers? <laughs> Uh, there is someone here that wanted to write Bernd an email. So why do you just connect with each other and <laughs> write an email together? Can we get a Dell and Bozo podcast? <laughs> the problem is that Dell is uh, spoken by someone out of the company. If that would be someone from the company, I think they would do it. Showing what they do there on the station when we're out in space. <laughs> you want to speak about something? You will find that a new item of research Yay. is available. Given what we have learned from our teleportation research, I believe we can apply it on a grand scale. This experiment will result in the relocation of this station to another position within this sector. That is, unless we run into some disastrous issue, of course. You know what? Since I'm doing the Astrea audiobooks, I understand how hard it is to do something like that. And sometimes it's hard to read whatever you have written down on your script. <laughs> and I believe that he said this line at least 10 times. <laughs> Relocation of this station? And then you're going like, and, and your mouth goes, uh, has got uh, an own brain and it goes like the relocation of the station like damn it again relocation of the station ah oh, damn it again the relocation of this station <laughs> it's not that easy as it sounds really not that easy it will be awesome if the character as a fleet officer offering missions ooh just cross his arms in stereo <laughs> I, I I think even in triple. Uh, so was that it? Did, that's all why you wanted to see me. High mass teleportation. There you go. Uh, but for that we need a lot of stuff. And we do have the production module thingy, and I need the storage module hack. Do we? Wait. Do we? Yes. If you could. Please gather the required materials. Oh wow, he's talking to you like that when you're doing in here. Huh, he's not even talking over the radio. Interesting. The water looks weird today. Or is it the glass? Looks weird today. <coughs> Um. Ha! Huh, we can now teleport everywhere. Awesome. I don't know what to do with that new freedom. Actually, what's our standing? <gasps> Twenty-seven! Woohoo! Do you know what that means? Do you know what that means? Plus 27? We can now teleport to every single ter Terran station without having a ship on it or whatever. We can also teleport to every single... Oh, no, we can't. But at least we can teleport to every single station. Without the need of any ship or anything there. Nice, Entering finally. System. So. You can only do that starting at plus 27. You know that? Do you know if it's possible to have one of my ships collect drops and then deposit them into the station? I can't figure it out. Yes. So that's pretty easy. Um, if you just take any ship, I don't know, and you do collect drops. By the way, it's even better than that. Uh, you can, you can do um, a repeat order. Repeat orders, confirm, and after you confirm that, you can do collect drops here, collect drops there, and collect drops here. What that does is your ship flies into the middle of, of that area. If there is something in there, it will collect it, and, and then we'll move on and go in here and collect the drops in here, and then we'll go in here and collect the drops here, 
and then start over. And it will do it all the time. All the time. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And when you're done, I mean, you don't use uh, inventory for that. And when you're done with all of that, you just right click on your headquarters and you do... Uh, it doesn't work because there's nothing on the ship, right? Is there something on the ship? Hmm, Picolito's fun boat. Ah, uh, the thing is, you need something on your ship, and then you can just right click on your on your uh, headquarters, and there will be um, uh, transfer inventory or so. You have to get. No, that was that was working. That was working. Last time I, I last time I uh, tried it, that was still working. Does it does it not work anymore? Hmm. Let me see. Wait. Um. Where do we have one? So, let me jump in here. Do not wave at the station security. I hustle space cave. Entering asteroid belt. That should no, that should usually work. So let me go in here. Let's run in Sita a little bit, so that we get some, so that we get some stuff. Oh no, the cock are back. Really? The cock are back. Are they here around? Oh my goodness. Anyway. Um Oh no. Damn it. We already lost one yeah, silicon miner. And that will be what? Another silicon miner? Damn it. Where's the police force when you need them? Okay, there we go. There's one. So. For example. There's your mineral miner. Collect the drop. Click that drop, please. What are you doing? Okay. Now you got it. Okay, that mineral miner now collected a drop. My goodness, that took long. And now if you're right clicking. Did they change that? Wait, that, wait, that's new. Is that... Maybe it was gone. There's nothing in the inventory. Collect, oh, okay, now it's gone again.
Okay, maybe that was just gone. It was not fast enough. Give me, give me a second. I have the urge to, to show you that it's still working. Usually that works. Collect the drop. Okay, let's let's do it with you. Let's see. Information. Inventory zero. Okay. Okay, now it got... Okay. There you go. Finally! <laughs> Whew, that took some time. That ship has got an inventory. It has got lodestone. My goodness. And now you click right-click. You kidding me? Transfer where? Huh? They changed... Wait, it's gone? Why is that gone? That bolo mineral has got inventory stuff. I think it broke in beta 8. Huh. Usually you had an order where you could say um, drop inventory or whatever. But what if we teleport to this guy? Entering system. Grand exchange. Weird. Um, so... Nothing's new here. Bolo. I'll take Mineral. the pilot seat. And the inventory is now... Okay. Now we get up. Had hey, the Bolo inventory is still one... Hello there. <laughs> How do you... Huh? How do you get the inventory then? Maybe try from the pilot? Can I help? Goodbye. I think they broke it. I mean... Drop items? No. Huh. Okay, this mechanic is broken. Huh. <clears throat> While he's seated. Okay. Let's wait wait for the uh, wait for the captain. Or can I calm him? Can I help? Hand me your inventory. Okay. Sir. But. Can I help? Come. Hand me your inventory. Okay, well, that's. Okay, that works. Um, but if we are <clears throat> on a different ship in the asteroid belt, it doesn't matter. Where, wherever. Okay. And now. Entering system. Sol. 
Ah, there, there it is. Ah, oh, okay. Sorry, I did it wrong. Barton, if you're still, <laughs> if you're still listening, my goodness, that took ages. I'm sorry. Um, if you're still listening, if your ship has got something in the inventory after it collected some stuff, right-click the ship. There it is. Deposit inventory. Deposit all inventory items the captain has at the HQ. Doesn't matter where the ship is, it will fly to the HQ, deposit it there, and will return to its orders. My goodness. That took ages. <laughs> ah! There it is. I knew it is somewhere. Yeah. So here it is. Deposit inventory. And that will deposit all your stuff. I don't know if you can do that with more than one single ship. Uh, I don't think you can do that for more than one single ship. So you have to um, click on everyone. I'm sorry that it took so long. <laughs> it took me about 20 minutes to get there. And I forgot to read everything. Um... The Dal and Bozo podcast was the last thing that I read. <laughs> to Turquoise Sea we go. Okay, yeah, okay. I have to do that. I have a ship already there. Entering system. Company regard. What is that? Cookery. Yay! Oh, that's our terracotta cookery. Nice. So, where do we fly to? Damn it, did I just... Adaptive steering is on? Should it be off? <gasps> okay. Why did that change? Kidding me? Huh? Oh, whatever. Okay. Let's just go there. Oh, that's weird. Why did they change that? Anything. Anyway. Uh... It's no big deal. I don't want to derail your stream. Ah, I, but actually, I was just in the last few minutes. I thought that we could do that really quick. <laughs> stream derail. St stream derailment is part of the stream. Exactly. Now we're back at the stuff that I told you at the start. The fluff. You just saw twenty minutes of the fluff. <laughs> I'm on 4.0 still, let me check. Okay. They changed location. Now try with repeat orders. Oh god. <laughs> Wait, does that... That is not an order that should work with repeat orders. No, that is... No, 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 no. That order is on top, so if you... If you have someone on repeat orders that is gathering stuff um, indefinitely and you take that one guy, you right click on it and uh, you send it to the HQ to deposit it, that ship will go back to the repeat orders after that. So it will clear that order and go back to the repeat orders. You still have to do it yourself. Fluff. <laughs> you can go to Turquoise Sea to the east or indeed to the south first. Okay, well. Oops, not that mode. Let's go. Oh, you saw the Hotas? <laughs> See? I told you, I told some of you yesterday that it's better to have just that small hat. Uh looking out here and that that will get people interested in it 
Actually, yep, yeah, that's the whole thing here. Oh my goodness. Ooh. That's what I like to do the most. <laughs> you get people interested if you just show Entering them system. teeny tiny Turn little bit. <laughs> Not all of it. <laughs> okay, where are we? What is this? That is already turquoise, see? So what, what are we going to do here? That's a... Oh, stop it. That's a split sector, isn't it? Light is disabled. What are we going to do here? Oh my god, big rocks. Used to play Elite Dangerous with Hotas and my wife had said, Wow. We listen to music and swim in sea. So, you sent me over here because of the music. Did you? Okay, I see. <laughs> Is there any other jump gate? I'm scanning. <gasps> There's a jump gate. Music is brilliant. Tell that Mr. Z uh, Zakharov. Zakharov? Hakarov. Zakharov. Alexei! Exactly. There you go. What is this? Still need to still need to use the mouse to do something like that. Unknown station. Should also make a button for disco mode. It doesn't work like that. I tried to do with with the with the sticky. Ah, oh, it works! Oh, <laughs> I did it! Ejecting. Damn it! for being part of Space Operations Delta today. <laughs> it's not stopping. It just goes and goes and goes and goes. <laughs> oh, what a showstopper. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here today for Space Operations Delta in X4. It was a pleasure to be your captain today. Thank you for all the support today. That was immense and that is amazing. That was that was extremely, extremely cool. Thank you for that. Also now some funky music for the last time. Like I said, we'll see us again on Sunday for the captain's coffee table. We're going in here. Thank you so much for being here. That was fun. Next week, a little bit earlier, 12 to 6 p.m. Longer, earlier, but longer. I'm sure you watch the stream, Captain, so you already know the music is brilliant. <laughs> I don't know if he does. That would be cool. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Uh, thank you. 
For the great words, Vumada and Barton, thank you so much. Betrent, thank you for all the support. Thank you, Grievous. Thank you, Barton, again. <laughs> thank you, guys. Amazing. That was insane. And Sarun, even more insane. Thank you so much for that. Um, Captain Rulewelt also coming in early with a tier 2 and, like, amazing. Thank you so much. For the for the choo choo, that was great. Um, <laughs> that that's all. That's that's all. Hmm. You say that. Um, I always want to see that. That's all not taken for granted. Exactly. That's always what I want to say, and uh, I get the words. That's not taken for granted, everything. It's amazing to have that kind of support. To be able to do it with only just Space Games NX4. Um, thank you so much. I guess you're going to block me now on Steam for... <laughs> no. <laughs> that was a good laugh. <laughs> thank you everyone that is new in here and enjoyed the time with us. We see this again on Sunday, like I said, X4 will remain on Thursdays. It just changes the time, but the X4 streams will remain on Thursdays. Uh, there's no change to that. There, once was a ship there you go. To see the name of the ship My last the honors. It was a pleasure to be a captain. Stay safe and healthy out there. I wish you all the best, all your families the best. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you, Space Operations Delta. Discord is open for everyone. Uh, I will be more in Discord in the next time, although I need to um, study a little bit more. <laughs> Don't tell my wife that I'm in Discord, okay? So, see you soon. Bye. Before the boat had hit the water, the whale's tail came up and caught her. All hands in the side harpooned and fought her when she dived down low. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue and is done, we'll take our leave and go. No line was cut, no whale was freed. The captain's mind was not on greed, but he belonged to the whaleman's creed. She took that ship in tow. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue and is done, we'll take our leave and go. For forty days or even more, the line went slack and tight once more. Our boats were lost, there were only four, Captain, and still that Captain whale did go. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue and is done, we'll take our leave and go. As far as I've heard, the fight's still on, the line's not cut and the whale's not gone. The wellerman makes his regular call to encourage the captain, crew and all. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue and is done, we'll take our leave and go. Soon may the wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue and is done, we'll take Hi. <laughs>